Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. Um, Chief, I am here because in the absence of the king, you, Chief Ogumba, the Onowu of Obodeno, are the highest voice in the land. And so I'm here to appeal to you to handle this matter that is brewing before it consumes us. Should I understand this to mean that you are technically challenging the tradition of the land? Mm -hmm. Far from it, Chief. I'm not challenging the traditions of the land, but I'm also saying that our women having to pass through hell at the hands of their men is also not part of our tradition. You would agree with me that our women have always had their place in the administrative framework of Obodem. So finally using tradition now to gouge them is not right. Where, I mean, where is this coming from? It is very strange to hear a man of Obodenu reasoning this way. I, 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 are you really part of us? Chief, I'm a man of Obodenu. And it is my duty to protect not only the women of Obodenu, but also women married into Obodenu. What a loka is doing to the wife. It's not right. It has to stop. But what did he do? Oh well, I mean, it's common knowledge that Eloka's wife supplies confectionaries and food stuff to hotels around this community. So recently, at a particular hotel, she had gone there to do her supplies as usual. And then she spotted Eloka coming out of a hotel room with a young lady. She was taking her back approached the husband to ask questions instead of Eloka giving answers what he did was to accuse the wife of coming to that hotel to come see a man how when he knows you know i know we all know that she was there on that day to make supplies that's all and i'm saying that what the man is doing to the woman is not fair we must stand up and speak against things like this uh, well, I am not going to wade into this issue until I have listened to both sides. I am chief. I am not asking that you take an action immediately. You can listen to it. It's fine if you want to listen to his side of the story. But what I have just told you right now is exactly what happened. Yeah, yeah, I, I, but I have not said you lied. What I am saying is that I can only take a position after I have listened to both parties. Please, tell Iloka to stop maltreating the wife. It is not good. I will do something. Sure. Thank you very much for your time, Chief. You're welcome. I'll be on my way. Okay. Uh, but if I can go, you really need to understand the rule. All the women who are married into Bodenu must pray never to catch their husbands doing their thing. Because when it happens, the one who has caught the thief most likely is the thief. Where are you, Eloka? I'm on my way home. If Ekego just left my house now. That fool. I guess he came to report me. Yes. Why is he always interfering in matters that do not concern him? Why? 
He's taking this thing serious now, and uh, we need to meet immediately as a family and discuss. How exactly did he put it this time? Listen, he is accusing you of infidelity and abuse of your wife. You see, why is he fickle like this? Eh? Why can't he mind his business? Why is he always going around poking his nose in matters that do not concern him? Why? That is why I said we need to meet as a family and take a standard on this. To avoid it escalating. No problem, Chief. I will see you later in the evening. I will be waiting. Okay, sir. Did this man change the lock? Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Over the new. Hey. Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Oh, but they know. Aye. Aye. Our women are not slaves. Our women are mm. not slaves. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Greetings, Eloka. Is your husband at home? At least answer my greetings. I don't need your greetings. Keep it to yourself. I said, is your husband at home? Why are you this upset? What's the problem? I'm not here for this nonsense. I ask the question and I demand an answer. And my question is, is your stupid husband at home? Okay. First of all, my husband is not stupid. And please, do not address him as such. He is stupid. I mean, he is very stupid. I should have added very. Very, very stupid. Since he goes about the village involving himself in things that has nothing to do with him. Hold on. I don't understand. What do you mean? Well, from all indications, your husband is not home. Tell him to mind his business in this Ogoden. If not, he will get it very hot from me. Okay, it's very unfair to threaten a fellow man like this. It's not nice, no matter what the problem is. No, 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 no. I'm not threatening yet. I just came to sound a note of warning. Since he has turned himself to a woman that goes around the village gossiping and involving himself in matters that do not concern him, tell him that if he ever involves himself in my affairs again, what I will do to him, even you, will not like it. Please, can you stop threatening your fellow man like that? It's not nice, no matter what the problem is. Okay, can you tell me exactly what he did so I can caution him from doing that again? I am not here to have that lousy, stupid discussion with you. No, I can't, I can't, I can't condescend that. Way. Tell him what I said. If he ever interferes in my family affairs again, he will get it very hot from me. At least tell me what he did. What did my husband do? At least answer me.
We can continue doing this here. You know this is a road. Why? People are passing. People could see us here, even your wife. Thank you, baby. Please. I'm in charge. And besides, my wife traveled. I know. And she wouldn't be back until month ending. Even at that, this is still. Are you not seeing me? People are passing. People could see us. Okay. Can we go to your house or at least you can rent a hotel room, can't you? That hotel room is the best mm. one. We are going there. But before we go, please, can you please take this down? No, we're going to do everything there. Yeah. You have committed an abomination and you're not worthy to live under the same roof with me again until you go for cleansing. What, what, what are you talking about? Are you not ashamed of yourself? I caught you cheating. Instead of you to acknowledge what you did, you are turning it on me. Look, look, if that is your plan, it will not work. It will not work. Wait, you have the guts to talk? No, no, you have the guts to lie right before me? Are you such an unrepentant liar? I caught you red-handed and all of a sudden you're turning it around. Hey, look, why would I talk? And what nonsense are you talking about? I caught you coming out of a hotel room with, 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 with your girlfriend. Now you're turning it around. Instead of you to apologize to me and make amends, you are here accusing me. Hey, look, see, 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 if that is your tactics, you see this reverse psychology that you're trying to do, it will not work. Oh, really? Yes, it will not work. You think I'm joking, right? Well, do I look like I'm joking? Too? No, you think I'm joking, right? No, I am joking. I have already reported it to my kinsmen, in case you don't know. <laughs> and what did you tell them? I exactly did? what happened. What happened? That the woman I have been living with, that I call my wife, has gone to stay with another man in a hotel. Hey. This, this, this is Overnight. Hey, look, why are you shooting yourself on the leg? No, you just shot yourself on the leg. Men like you are not supposed to bring yourself out for ridicule. Because that's what you're doing. Oh, really? Yes, because everybody knows who you are. And yet, one in Bamili. And yet, one in Bamili. And yet, one in Bamili. Listen to me. What? See, let me tell you. I caught you red-handed in the hotel where you went to see one of your numerous boyfriends and you slept overnight. That is what I have told my kinsmen. Hey, look, I really, why are you twisting what happened? No, really, I, I don't understand. Why are you twisting what happened? I caught you in a hotel walking out with one of your, one of your numerous girlfriends. And then now you're turning it around. Well, let me tell you something, hey, look, if you think you can put this on me, it will not stand. Hey, look, it will not stand. She's beautiful. What a maka. You can say that. Hey! I will manage her or if any more than me. You know what? Hey, yeah, wait. What the love maka? It come. 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 You know, I like the things, eh? One of these days, you... You arrange something like this for me, eh? Where did you wear your coat? I can't see. Uncle. If you want them this night, I promise you, I will give you two or three at once. <laughs> and I do quite Yeah! I will package them. Please. <laughs> I need this thing more than you do. <laughs> oh, I go on one day. No, yeah, okay. I am. I am tested and trusted. <laughs> 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 ah, I'm Ah, don't toy with me. 
I am tested ah! and trusted. Yeah? It's your pity. Don't arrange it for me. Yeah? You can never change. How can I change? <laughs> I cannot change. Uh, you, you, you look good, man. Thank you. You're not, you're not doing badly. Omo ifo, omo isa ko bo asa da se da. O ifo ni. Ba ye ti bo mo. Ada bo bo da we ne we ne. Na na pya pya pa do. O ko to ke. Ada o ko to ke. Eh o ko please I have to. I don't want to keep up with it for too long. Oh, so that eh. Man man want to talk, want to talk about that eh eh. When the woman has eh uh, you don't have to wait you. <laughs> Fire on. <laughs> this Please, don't forget your promise. Our uncle didn't know. Me, forget. <laughs> hey, baby. Leave me alone. Leave what me alone. is it now? What I told it? you I don't like this place. I told you this is a road. Mkichiri, you worry yourself too much. Eh? You worry yourself too much. He's my uncle. What if it was not your uncle? What if he was not your uncle? <sighs> what if it was someone else, your wife, or maybe someone else who could have told on us? Listen, I am the man here. And I want you to know that I'm fully in charge. I mean, follow me. Play along with please, please. me. Just relax your mind and enjoy me, baby. We are going up now. Let's go. <laughs> They've been cheated on, accused so wrongfully. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us. Ah, hmm. Uh. What's going on? Why is your face like that? Not even jumping on me to hug me. What? You didn't miss me, baby. Yes. I look how I was here thirty minutes ago. What does he want? He came to warn you to stay off his family affairs. Wow. So I go to work and he look and decides to come to my house. He's like I didn't meet him here. But I taught him a lesson that he would never, ever forget. I don't understand. Do you want to fight a If I had seen that idiot here, I would have taken him to the cleaners and, and put him where he belongs. Why? Why did he show up here? No, for what exactly? Why did he show up here? For what? What for? Babe, don't you think you should mind your business? Oh, well, I have tried. But I just can't. The level of injustice meted out on the women of Obodeno by our men is, is unpardonable. It's, it's, it's appalling. These men are destroying the minds of our women. And you know what I'm talking about. They are bent on, 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 on breaking these women and, and destroying womanhood. Someone has to talk about it. Someone has to stand up for them. Baby, it is none of our business. Don't you think we are exposing ourselves too much? Look, just imagine the way Eloka came here. He was so upset that he can do anything. He cannot do jack. Eloka is a bloody weakly neophyte. His only strength lies in humping different women. That's all. But when we forget, man, listen to me. It's already laid in my heart to speak for our women. And I'm not going to stop. No one would intimidate me into silence. It wouldn't happen. Honey. I know what you're trying to achieve. But the men of Obodeno are so evil, they can hurt you. They cannot, they, they can't do jack. They can't hurt me. Truth never killed anyone. Looks like you don't know the man you marry. When I make up my mind to do anything, I follow through till the end. Hey, look. Hey, look, I came here. Today is his lucky day. So, by the way, it's fine. 
please let me a glass of juice to come down. <coughs> Baby, I, I am bothered. I am bothered. Don't like this. <coughs> Accordingly, he comes by my house to intimidate my wife. Hey, look, I'm from Luzwaga. Will you be able to confront me one on one? I go out, she decides to show up here to intimidate my wife. Huh. It's fine. Hey, look, huh? I'll see you soon. Wherever you want to take me to, I'll go with you. Because enough of all this ill treatment, I've had it up to here. What did I do wrong? You have done everything wrong by cheating on me. And I will not let you go scot free this time. <laughs> hey, look, anywhere you call me, I will answer you. Okay. Because God in heaven knows, my bassy, I am innocent. Yeah? But for now, open the door. Let me take, take my bags inside. Inside where? Which bags? I said, open the door. Let me take my bags inside. What do you mean, which bags? My bags. That means you didn't hear what I said before. That you have committed an abomination and you're not worthy to live under the same roof with me. Didn't you hear it before? <laughs> hey, look, you're joking. <laughs> this, this is a joke, right? Yeah, look at my food very well. Does it look like the face of a joker? No, do I look like who appears on this because we show? Hey, look, what is your problem? No, really, what, what have I done to you? Like I said, no problem. Anywhere you want to take it to, no problem. Just open the door. Let me go inside. Please, and, I'm tired. And I said you are not going anywhere. Yes. Okay, fine. Where, where, where do you expect me to stay? Wherever you like. Anywhere you like. Hey, look, are you serious right now? Take this your frustrated bags and, and get out of my compound. Why are the men in this town doing this? My sister, they feel it's their right to cheat on their wives, coupled with the cleansing tradition that they have manipulated. <laughs> Honestly, if I'm to be married in this town, I will not take this from them. <laughs> what will you do? I will cheat. If my husband <laughs> cheats on me, I will do the same thing. My dear, we need to let these men know that they do not have the monopoly of cheating. Look, cheating on a cheating husband is not the best way to solve the problem of this nature. This is the best way to lay this matter to rest. They keep cheating because their wife, their women, keep crying and staying in the same spot without finding or taking any action. My dear, this is the part of African tradition that I hate the most. I don't think Cheating is part of African tradition that our great grandfathers left for us. Because my father never cheated on my mother, all the while they were married. So where do African men learn this cheating habit? That is a big question I might not be able to answer. You see, you can't answer to this question. This is the same way so many women in this our community not just in this community, the entire Africa cannot answer to this question. And because the question is left unanswered, these men will continue to have their ways in their cheating escapades. Well, you're right. I just hope the women will speak up to the occasion one of these days because we cannot continue to be treated as if we're born differently from these men. <laughs> Honestly, the only way to rise to this occasion is to speak up. Because women are not slaves in their husbands' houses. You're right. We just have to speak up. Because if we don't, the same thing will fall on us when we are married. My dear, do you know the parts that pay me the most? The fact that these men know that they cheat, but this community will protect them and allow the women to suffer. Oh, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? Great eyes full of tears. Uh, well, I want to welcome you once again, my brothers and wife. You are all welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I want us to go straight to this meeting. I don't want us to waste time so that those of us 
who still have businesses to attend to, we go back to their business. <laughs> exactly. Somebody like me that is very busy. Eh? I still have some supplies to do today. And transactions too before the end of today's business. Yeah. <laughs> what, what kind of thing? Well, then look, you are the man. And I, I'm going to give you the floor first. Can we hear you? Chief, thank you. I went to Airport View Hotel to see my friend who happens to be the manager of the hotel. You cannot believe what I saw in the hotel. You cannot believe what I saw in the hotel. Hey, look, hey, look, let's go. Ah, you don't do that. Ah, how can you be whipping even in front of your own wife? You don't do that now. Be a man. Hey, look, my brother. Please, be good. Jidobiaka, be a man. Talk to us, we are here for you. Okay. I went to see the manager. After meeting with him, I was leaving his office, going through the long passage that will lead you into the main compound. Now, if any of you have visited the hotel, you will understand what I'm trying to say. As I was passing through that long passage, lo and behold, I saw one young man it should be about 27 or 28 years walking hand in hand with my own wife <laughs> hand in hand like very romantic cuddling the heartbreaking part of it that the man was tapping her by the buttocks power 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 it's to me he's lying this is a big lie he's lying against me anete please ah. anete please Stop interrupting this discussion. I will still ask you to speak when your time comes. This is him that I've given the floor. Oh, please continue. Oh, he said, I'm lying. Tell me, why would I lie against my own wife? Why? Why? I confronted her. In the first instance, she denied knowing me. She, de she denied that she does not know who I am. Hey. Because she was with her boyfriend. Eh? It was until the manager came out and asked the stupid boy to get out of the hotel. That was when she now started acting like she knows me. My brothers, please. No, 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 Ask this my wife. This woman that I loved so much. All of you know how much I love my wife. To tell me what is it I have not done. Please tell me. I will do it for you. Stop cheating on me now. What do you stand to gain? Eh? What have I not done? It's okay. It's okay. Hi. Uh, we have heard you. Uh, Anete, uh, the floor is now yours. Uh, can we hear from you? Thank you, Chief, for giving me the floor. Thank you for granting me audience. My husbands, I, I thank you all. As you all know, my business is supplied mostly to hotels. The hotel my husband is talking about is one of the hotels I supply to, the Airport View Hotel. Everybody knows my business. Yesterday we woke up, we all got ready and went to our different businesses. We went to the shop. I went about my supply business. By the time I came back, my husband was not back. Later in the day, I tried calling him to know why he's not back because it's the usual time he comes back. I couldn't get him on the phone. I kept trying. Till late in the night, I was lucky to get him on the phone. I called him, he said he will not be coming back yesterday night, that his goods just came in. His container just arrived. Being that I know the kind of business my husband does, I understood. I did not argue. I prayed for him. I told him be careful because I know where the market is and I know how the, the area is. Because you have plans. Because you get plans, you get intention. Mabasi. Naturally, she should pray for the husband. She did well. She did well. Eloka. Ha! My husbands, like I was saying, I prayed for my husband, went to bed. The following day, which is this morning, I woke up in the morning, 
got ready and went about my business. I even made breakfast for him in case he comes back before me. Tell me where I have gone wrong here. Let me finish the story. I went about my supply business and one of the places I went to this early morning was the Airport View Hotel he talked about. Immediately I came into the hotel, the first person I was seeing coming out from one of the rooms was my husband. With a girl by his side, they were holding hands. Hey! Me? Uh, 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 wait, wait, uh, my wife, wait, uh, hey, Luca. Uh, Iko, dear wife, uh, chief, uh, Ichi Abit. What these people have succeeded doing is confusing us. I mean, here I am, Meredeka, I run on no no, go see a ditch. Now, who is telling us the truth and who is lying? Uh, hold on, tell you. You see, uh, in answer to that question, uh, hey, look, uh, we all knew him from childhood. Yeah, he's not someone to come out and uh, start telling bare-faced lies. Eh? Uh, we know him. He's all, he always tells the truth. I have not exhausted the truth in my mouth. How will I tell lies? You see, that is, uh, Mabasi, are you saying you believe this cock and bull story he just told you now? So in other words, you're saying I, I am I'm, I'm lying. I did not say that. No, he I said your wife is lying. No, That's what you're saying. I did not say you are lying. All I'm saying is that I know him from childhood. He is not a liar. Why would I lie against my own husband? I don't know. I don't know. I'm wondering why you are lying against me. Why would you lie? Uh, 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 wait, wait. It's all right. Chief uh, Ozodema, Ichi Abiti. The hotel manager in question happens to be my very close friend and I have his phone number. So for us to know the truth, I will call the hotel manager now to tell us what actually happened. Hey, 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 when you follow things, yeah, you start from the beginning so that every other thing will fall into proper perspective. That is how things are done. You understand me? That's Listen. The, they call it protocol. Protocol. Good. Protocol. That's what we call it. Yeah? So, listen to me. You have to wait. That call should not be made now. Eh? Chief is here. He has not said anything. You want to make a call. Is that how things are done? Hold on, my friend. Uh, Chief, yes, please. Yes, thank uh, you very much. Uh, well, um, um, yes, yeah, yeah. Uh, is, she, is she happy? Is she happy? Like always, you have hit the, the hammer on the head. Wow. Like a good man. Uh, well, um, and yet, uh, our wife, I have listened to you, and I have equally listened to your husband. Uh, allow us to discuss this thing as, um, as a family. Yes. Uh, you, you may leave us now. Uh, I, will, I will get back to you. Thank you, my husband. Hey! Thank you. Oh, I have no idea. Be careful. Be careful out there. Good one, I have no idea. Hey! I'm going to be late. 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 No, no, no. So, had it been... You see, but it didn't stop you. You would have made that call. Mm. Because the only one has read it. I will be. Only I will be. You will be. You want to call me? What would you have told the manager? Only I will be the major one. Only I. How do you know? Hey, 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 hey. Where are you going to? I'm going to church, of course. Okamaka, I'm beginning to get uncomfortable with the way you are going to church in this house. How do you mean? Listen, you're always in church today. We are in church tomorrow. If you're not talking about Reverend Father A today, you're talking about Reverend Father B tomorrow. Okamaka, what is wrong with you? No, wait, is it because your name is Okamaka that you want to turn going to church into a profession? What is it? Bernard, 
Honestly, I could not make out a thing for what you've just said right now. Hmm? When did you start having issues with me going to church in this house? When? I don't have issue with you going to church, Okamaka. All I'm saying is that you should cut it down. Ah. Okamaka, what I'm saying is that from today, you're going to church in this house should be curtailed. I am sorry to disappoint you. I am sorry to disappoint you, Bernard. You cannot stop me from worshipping my God. It's not happening. It's not. Nobody is stopping you from going to church or worshipping your God. What I'm saying is that you should use your time for something precious. And, and, and give value to, the, to your family. Give attention to your family. No, really? Yes. Why don't you allow me to worry about that myself? Oh. Yes. Okay, my God, this is 4.33 p.m. I'm expecting you back here on or before 6 p.m. Okay, do so. Failure to do that. Failure to do that. Okay, do so. See you later in the evening. Um, meanwhile, what would you like want to have in the evening so I can quickly rush up to the market? Don't I'm bother about that. I'll take care of myself. Are we men and not slaves? Are we men and not slaves? Kobo denu Are we men and not slaves? Are we men and not slaves? With eyes full of tears The women always cry uh, Well, hey, Luca. Your wife is gone And I've just got her from my good man That she has left the compound so I believe you can now feel relaxed and tell us exactly what happened. Uh, my brothers, to be honest and sincere, my wife's version of the story is the true story. Why, why, why the outrageous lie? Why do you have to lie against that woman and make the poor woman pass through such pain? Madoka, who did that? Listen, we are sitting here now as brothers and that's why he is Opening up, uh, telling us the truth. Pichia, Pichia, I don't know what you're trying to say. Iloka here cheated on the wife, lied against her. You must go and apologize to her. I will not do such thing. I will not try it. Then, Iloka, you leave me with no other option than to walk straight to your wife and tell her that you admitted committing the crime. <laughs> Eh? Okay. Marika, can you beat your chest and tell us here that you have never cheated on your wife for once? Hey, look, or is there anything between you and my wife? I have cheated on my wife. I cheat on my wife, yes. But your ways is different from mine. If I cheat on my wife, Eloka, I will always find a way to placate her, to make her feel happy. I mean, so that my family will continue to grow and will live happily. Beautiful. Thank God you said your way is different. I am not you. You are not me. So we can do it the same way. Uh, I will not try it. I will not apologize. Chief, we all cheat. That is the truth. But when you are not caught, you, in fact, you assume to be innocent. Why are you sounding as if you are not a man of Obodenu? I wonder. You are confusing me. Huh. No, have you ever seen any man of Obodenu apologize to the wife before? I have not. But Eloka, he has to start it. Why must Eloka be the one that was started? Because Eloka cheated on the wife. And before us, lied against the poor woman. Eloka, you must go and apologize to that woman. Okay. If you fail to do that, Eloka, you are evil. You are evil. No, Madoka, you are the one that is evil. And all of us here know that you are evil. Eloka, what you did to your wife, I will never do to mine or any other woman like that. Sorry. Hey, Luca, go and apologize to that poor woman. Tell her you're sorry. Failing to do so, I repeat, you are evil, come, personified. Come, come and bundle me now. Come, come and bundle me. Please, 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 let's forget this matter. Yeah? Uh, we've, uh, I've listened to both of you. All these wrong things are not going to help us. Chief is here. He has the final say. Yeah, no, 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 no. I'm already pondering on, on the whole thing. I've listened to everybody. I've listened to even a mother who is just talking like I don't understand. 
I've pondered and I am still pondering. And I will soon say something. Trust me, of course. Yeah, no, no. When I will say something, you will like what I will say. Bob, uh -uh. I trust you. Uh, 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 I don't know what he has with my wife. Uh, you will tell to my wife. I can tell. You will tell me what you are doing with my wife. Uh. You will tell me what you are doing with my wife. Don't worry, I will set trap for two of you. I'll catch you. I'm there. I'm. What? I don't know if you will start teaching the children the catechism. Huh? Father, I know I can do that very well. Yeah. And I will be pleased to do that. Yeah, you will be teaching them because I know you can do that well. Yes, I'm a very nice person. So you can do that well. You still have the spirit of God in you. Yes, so I, can, I, can, I can teach them. Uh -huh. I think I can do it with Please. the help of our Virgin Mary. Definitely. Just you can to make up your mind, eh? Thank right. you very much, sir. Say hi to your husband. Time. I don't know, I don't have my watch with me. And what time did I ask you to come back? You said 6 p.m. This is 6.37 p.m. Why are you coming back by this time? Bernard, you four people know that it's not my fault. I'm not the one in charge of the proceedings today. The program lasted more than I thought. Who brought you back? Father Calisto did. Why why is it why is it what to bring you back to church? Why are you asking all these questions? Is there any problem? I don't understand. Now listen. Today will be the last day you go to that church again. Did I make myself clear? Bernard, is my going to church affecting you in any way? Yes, it's affecting me. How is it affecting you? Tell me. Are you supposed to answer that question? Yes. Okay. Fail to hit my word. Let me see you in that church again. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. What's this problem? It's getting out of hand. A women are not slain. No, we're gonna hear this again. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Brother, I don't know why you always shy away from this. Each time I want us to talk about it. I'm not sure anything from it. I was actually thinking that my body language would have given you an inkling as to what my position is at this point. But I'm not a magician to know what your body language is. The way you are sounding it is as if you have something to, to say. Alright, fine. So let me save you the period work. I have thought about it. And I have decided that it would not be best for you to travel abroad. But why? Well, because you're my only brother who is very stubborn, who lives an unstable life, who is still trying to find himself. But the character that you carry, I send you abroad, you are going to dissolve into thin air. And that will be the end. Brother, I'm going abroad to hustle for the betterment of our family. If I make it there, I will obviously bring the money home. H D man. All the money you want to make abroad, and you think you can make abroad, is here in Nigeria. All you need to do is open your eyes. <laughs> you are kidding me. 
No, you are kidding me. Where is the money? Where is the money when there is no job in this, in this country? If you want a job, I'll give you a job in my country. I can make do with extra hands. You're my brother. Come, let us work together. Let's grow. My business has beautiful prospects and we know it. We can grow it into a big empire and I promise that at the end of the day, I will settle you and set you up here in Nigeria. But I don't want to do your business. I don't want to do your business. I want to travel abroad. Well, then I do not have money to send you abroad. Why are you being mean to me? Am I not your only brother? I, I don't like this thing you are doing. No. I seriously do not like this thing you are doing, brother. I'm not being mean to you. On the contrary, I, I love you. Look around you. Most business owners and entrepreneurs would not let their family members come to us. But here I am. Begging my own brother to come join me, to come work with me. Hmm? Come, let's work together. It will profit you here. Instead of going abroad and facing an, an uncertain future, think about it. If it's something that you want to do, get back to me with rock and roll. There is nothing to think about. There is absolutely nothing to think about. If you have made up your mind not to help me to achieve my dreams of traveling abroad, then I'll do it myself. You see, this character of yours is what has kept you in this condition. Just to stop it. What stubbornness does is it blocks your mind. And you begin to miss out on opportunities set up all around you. I'm giving you a great opportunity to be big in life. But you're throwing it back at me. Nichidene, you have to grow up. You don't have all that time. And you have to grow up. You have to make a change. And the time for that change is now. So again, think about it. If there's something you want to do, you come to me. You rock and roll. Like I said before, there's nothing to think about. Since you have made up your mind not to help me, no problem. Bye bye, what? My friend! Hi, hey, how are you? I'm okay. And you? I'm fine. This mm. one, you're mm. looking this good. What's the good news? Everyone just proposed. <laughs> <laughs> this is good! I was shocked when he asked me to marry him. I'm so happy for I you. Know. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so, when is Echidin going to propose? My dear, he's not even talking about marriage now. The only thing in his head is just for him to travel out. That means you have to start looking elsewhere. Why would you say a thing like that? Look, you're my friend. And you're not getting any younger. Look, you have to get a serious guy. And save yourself from impending embarrassment from this guy. No, please don't say that. He is not an embarrassment. Mm, okay. mm? I know you are going to say that. But as your friend, I'll keep telling you, even though it's hot. I'll keep telling you. Okay, okay, okay. Today is not the day for that. Uh -huh. It's a happy time! Getting married. Oh no! Please, please, just let me get to something. <laughs> Am I too small that you, you walk past me? Did you see me? See, Bruce, I have anything to say with you. I'm on my way going to some important you, will, you, will, you, will you come back here? Are you stupid? No, are you stupid? How can you walk past me without greeting me? You're looking for my trouble. I'm looking for your trouble? Yes. Okay? It's very obvious that you do not greet people in your family. 
including your mother and your father. Why me showing my parents is written by force? Hmm? Anyway, you know, I don't blame you. It's very obvious that you lack manners. It's you that lack manners, not me. You, you come back here. What did you say? No, what did you say? That I lack manners. Are you stupid? Are you stupid? Huh? You lack manners. You lack manners. Are you, are you okay? Are you stupid? No, come back here. Can you imagine this smoke here? It's not your fault. No, I, I'm very sure that small, small boys have been toasting you. That's why you have the God to talk back at me. And because you're using Infinity's phone now. No, you're using Infinity's phone. And there's no problem. Let me see who will give me like thinking now for this one now. Abuzin kita lisian sana, esel lebih. This is injustice. Enu nana mana kamu dia jauh. How can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, hey, where is your father? Um, he left. He left. Mm -hmm. I thought I told him that I was trying to make food for you too. I guess it was that time. Right. Honey, what happened? Can I eat? Not even to talk about it today, but please. Let's... Baby, you know it's not possible for me to forget about your father. Did you just say something that made him get upset? Well, I made the young man understand my position and was quite to travel abroad. And he got upset and he left. Why is he still insisting on traveling abroad? Because he believes that I have money to waste. I know that boy, I know Ichidime, he's, he's unsettled, he has his, his head in the clouds. I send him abroad, he's going to disappear and never come. Let me not forget to add that I even offered him a job in the company. You know, he said no. He must travel abroad. Um, well, babe, I really don't see that as an issue. Well, I see it as an issue, which is why I'm not going to throw my money away. Okay, baby, so why don't you find a way to relate it to him so he won't feel like you're doing this deliberately? How else am I to relate it to him? What else am I to do? I don't understand. Leak his anus? Who cares how he feels about my decision? I don't care. Oh, well, babe, so at this point, this is where you get it all wrong. Uh, sweetheart, that your business is getting cold. Let me eat it. Let's go eat. I don't understand why your brother is going to have such amount of money and he doesn't want to send you abroad. I just feel like I say, if you say if you travel, Ujander, you will make this money more than him. Exactly. Oh, put it in your head, big game. Exactly. But see, eh, I don't care. If a Kego must give me that money, whether he likes it or not, he must give me that money. You know, I just wonder. Sometimes I would just try one put one and two together to understand his line of reasoning. You have the money, you have the lands, you have the property. What exactly is wrong with him? Why you know why give you this money? Wouldn't be in wouldn't be in problem. You just said it now. Your head the game. If a Kego feels that if he gives me that money or probably send me abroad, that I will make him more than him. He knows me now. I'm gonna walk in with Lobby. I get mine. He knows. 
Mbaya deba. Guy. You get what I mean now. You be like say you go need to beg them for the money. See, no reason now. No reason now. I just feel like see, see, see no one willingly give you the money. You be like saying you want to make you come. Pay some kind of loyalty. You understand? I beg. I beg. No. Who put that beg? I beg. I beg. I tell God beg you. Beg you. Beg you. Beg you for to go over my dead body. My person, my man. I won't do it. No one will I beg him now. Why will I beg my own brother, my own blood brother, to do what he's supposed to do? It's not possible now. It's not possible. I can't beg him. I will do that. He must send me abroad. You know, get choice, so. You know, get CB. Oh boy. You sure say you really want Trump. You sure say you want Jackpa. You want go jald. You sure? This guy. Why do you need to talk this thing? Why do you need to talk? If I don't want to travel, I will talk I want to travel. What's the day for me for this country? I don't get anything here. My future no day here. You know it. I want to travel. Mm. If I see the money today, today, today or tomorrow, guy will leave this town. Mm. See, eh? since your brother no one give you the money, and if he say you need to get the money your own way, if he miss you, your own way. Wait. You mean by stealing? Yes! Yes, now! Nah. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Calm down. Calm down. <laughs> See, your brother get the money. He doesn't want to give it to you. You kwa, you don't want beggar for the money. So the only thing for you to do now and here is to go to his shop, lift some goods, sell it on a gum gum, and move. I'm not a thief now. I can't do that. See. Si. I don't have to stay in his thing in order for me to travel. All I know is that my brother will sponsor me. He has no choice. But to stay in his thing, or got my hand no day. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I know if you do, I'm a beg. I beg. That is not an option. You Be are lily livered. You are lily livered guy. You never ready to travel because if you ready to travel, you could do this thing. You could do this thing. To go steal? Or got no fee steal? Now you brought that. Thing. It's not see, it's not really stealing. You just be like say they borrow him for some time. Just look at like that. Borrow. Yes, now. But you no give me now. Stealing, be say no give me. And you no approve him. So now stealing. See what I even say. You no put I you know my guy. Eh hey, now, you know my guy. Your papa gave so many land. Guys, say one give me. If I travel few years ago, I go, I go, I go. Why are you back the money? Eh. Uh. Hey, eh now. Make I say my papa land give you. Make you travel. You know my guy now. You're my guy. Me now your guy. Mm -hmm. You want me to sell my papa property? Give you the money. When money they smell for a house. Money they smell for a house. Eh? Everything day, property day. You can't even tell me, say, make I sell my papa line and give you. How you serve? How, 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 how this is the way you take talk? I taste for your mouth. I taste for your mouth. Guy, give friends with better pass, brother. Eh? Be that friend. Make me proud, guy. If I travel, I give you, matter, matter, one year. I go give you back the money. Based on why now? Nah, I got really this thing. No. We go save you, my guy. I'll leave this talk, I beg you. So, you know if you do it for me? Your brother, I know if you do it for you, that you are going to Someone need to stand up, someone need to rise, someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand, our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Go for out. So I saw this online and. I thought I'd show you because I can't purchase it. Ah. <laughs> it's, nice. it's a skincare product. I like it. It's nice. 
so I can go for it. Yeah. I think you should. <laughs> Amaka, why are you crying? She didn't attack me and took my phone. What? Why? You see that no victim. Bina asked him if victim is by force. Okay, come here. Okay. It's okay. It's okay, okay? So he collected the phone from you, not a way of stealing it, but because she did not greet him. Yes. Calm down. I'll get it for you, okay? Okay. Okay. We can start going now, okay? Okay. What is this? No, what is the meaning of this? No, honey, I'm asking you because you, you keep protecting that boy. What is the meaning of this? I keep telling you there's something wrong with that boy. What they did they, they did not greet him. And so what? When did greeting become by force? Why does he go around town fomenting trouble? Eh? Baby, please don't tell me to calm down. No, don't tell me to calm down. I, I keep telling you that boy. That boy is giving me troubles. If he does anything now, he's arrested. It, it, it falls back to me. Don't worry, I'll get the phone back. You better get the phone. Because I, I know his plans. He intends to get that phone, sell the phone, and split the money amongst his goons. That's, that's his intention. I can tell you that for free. Please. Please, get that phone. I'm not going to take it lightly with him. If he does not return that girl's that I hate any kind of oppression. Can you please relax, okay? Just calm down. Before they put him in why is he intimidating the girl? Make an area. Oji Wanya Kenenia. Oji Police Senate President. Talk to your boyfriend. Though. Talk to your boyfriend. What is the problem in Chiapete? You are my brother, you should not be scared of me. Looking at you, I can see there is something you are itching to say. Uh, can you just go ahead and say it? I will find a way around it. Chief, uh, you see, you are my brother. Yeah, of course, I said it already. But you are also the owner of War of the Kingdom. Uh, so I have to accord you that respect. Uh, besides, your wife and your children are in the UK. Does not water down the fact that uh, this is still your family house. Because it is. Eh? <laughs> Belongs to, to them. That is why I'm finding it difficult to uh, say exactly what I want to say. But this year, you are already in my house and you are here before me. Say what you want to say. We will find a way around it. Chief, Chief. Of course, sure. Uh, uh, Chief. Uh, you see, I. Uh, I, I need your help, as usual. You see everything. If this help is financial help, please, I want to tell you, it is not going to be possible now. Chief, must it always be financial help? You've been doing your best for us. Eh? You're not going to kill yourself for us, are you? <laughs> no? Uh -uh. Then what is the problem? Uh, uh, Chief, this is a very special help I need from you. You see, I have this girlfriend of mine I want to arrange, uh, package and repackage, explore. Yeah. And uh, I, need, uh, I need your boy spotter. I don't want my wife to start losing. Is this yeah. is this what you are finding difficult to say boldly as a man of a brain? Uh -huh. Chief, like I said, you are my brother, fine. But you are still the only wolf of within the kingdom. Yeah? Yes, uh, in the absence of the Igwe, you are the next in command. Yeah? Igwe or Neme, when you say something, it happens, and that's it. Yeah? <laughs> you know, should I tell you that you are too much is happy today? I, I, I am still surprised how you do this, how you manage to get all these girls so fast. 
and you keep exploring them. <laughs> How do you even do this? Uh, Chief, I don't know. <laughs> when you continually eat a goose soup every day, a goose, every day, a goose, a goose, a goose, the soup will lose the gooseiness in it. <laughs> so you have to miss it. I think I understand where you're coming from. So, what is it that way? Yeah. This is the key to the boy's one. Chief, chief. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. That is why I'm proud of you as my brother. <laughs> yeah, I'll get back to you later. Go ahead. Chief, please. Eh? Uh, in case my wife calls uh, to know where I am, you know, she will always believe that I'm with you uh, every time. So she, will, in case she calls you to find out, please tell her you have not seen me for even one week. <laughs> Because of course, I know what to tell her. Yeah. That is if she will develop the courage to even make that call. Oh, in the first place. <laughs> don't worry. You, Go ahead. No, 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 David, <laughs> sorry for keeping you waiting. Eh? Uh, let's go, let's go. I hope you didn't tell him I'm the one you're with. Why would I tell him that? Why would I tell him that? Does he tell me when he does his own? No, don't, don't even go there. You know, yeah. I'm still surprised that we came here. This is like disrespecting the wife. Which wife are you talking about? No, the wife that left her husband here and is living in UK. Whatever she sees, she will take. Yeah, It's not her business. Let's go. I hope your wife won't come here looking for you. Even if my wife comes here, she will not see us. Because we'll be inside the room, eh? Lock ourselves inside the room in the post quarters, eh? Put on the AC and um, enjoy the press up. Eh? <laughs> no, let's go and enjoy ourselves. I would have still preferred the hotel though. Which hotel? I'm going to the hotel. I'm going to the hotel. Let's go, eh? 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 Hey! Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Oh, but then, oh, I, I, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Actually, you will not pick my call. You will not pick my call because you know what you have done. Women always crying because they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Our men are treating us like slaves. Oh, so we oh. need to stand up. <laughs> the number I have called is switched off. Oh, now you have turned off your phone. Someone Actually, you, may, you have turned off your phone, eh? Keep running. Keep running, HDM. Eh? But you are going to return that phone to that girl. You don't know me. Anyway, you know me. You just want to try. Hey, look at locking me outside here is wickedness, and you know it. Because I did not do this. What, why, why are you look, locking me outside? You want me to sleep outside here? Well, up, voila. If you like, keep knocking there from now to tomorrow. It will not change anything. Hey, look at this is unfair. This is unfair. Why are you treating me as if I'm not a human being? Why are you treating me as if I'm not a human being? This, this is not unfair. It's unfair now. You started it. You started it by cheating on me. Look, Mabasi, I did not cheat on you. I did not cheat on you. You know this. What, what, what is this? There is only way to prove your innocence that you did not cheat on me. That is going for prison. 
Eloka. Eloka, Eloka, you know you. Why am I going for cleansing? Why am I going for cleansing when I did not do anything? When I did not do anything, rather you're the one who hurt me, and now you're the one punishing me. Continue to call it nonsense. Continue to call it nonsense. As long as you are still claiming innocence, you are compounding your problem. This is how you want it, right? This is how you want it. No problem. No problem. I will not submit myself for any cleansing. I am not going anywhere. I did not do anything wrong. You must go for cleansing before you're able to enter into this house. No, to open it up, but no problem. Someone need to rise, someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to, to rise and fight. No. Now about drink, we have spirits, we have beer. I'll drink spirits, but that will be later. Okay. So we can discuss the reason I called you here. I already know the reason why you called me. As of the phone, I have sold it. Elegonia, straight up. Do you know how people look at you when they realize you sold the phone? Do I care? No. Does it look like I care? That girl has the gut to insult me. Me hechi di me. Okay. Relax, okay? For the girl, we will talk about her later. But for now, let's talk about the phone. Who did you sell it to? Um, I've not sold the phone yet. But I'm not giving it back to her. I can't give it back to her. I'll draw possible. What you do, man? I am the one talking to you. And I am begging you with whatever you hold sacred. Why are you doing this? Do, do you know that you're not just spoiling your name, but the reputation of this family? Do you know what it takes to build up a reputation? And you're just going to destroy it because of a mere phone? Who does that? Look at me. Do you know how your father is going to feel wherever he is about this, this, this whole mess you're putting up? I am asking you, please, don't do this. It's okay. Um, just because of what you said though, concerning Papa, just because of Papa, I will return the food. Because of Papa and the way you talk to me. If it's for your husband that keep ranting and sending me threatening messages, just because of you and Papa. So my husband sent you messages? Yes, now. He sent me a message and was calling me, threatening me. Eh? If it's because of him, I will not return this phone. Nothing will make me to return this phone. Okay. At least you've brought it. Thank you so much. No save my person. My personal person. Yeah, I know. And that is why I gave you the phone. It's just that you don't want to help me to convince your husband to send me abroad. Eh? I don't know why you don't want to help me on that. I have. I've been doing that. But don't worry, he'll come around. Oh? Really? Yes. <laughs> My person now. Yes, I'm your person. And this is the best news I've heard for a very long time. You know what? what? Go and get the food. Uh -uh. I want to eat the food. I want the beer, the drinks, so anything you have inside this house, bring it out. <laughs> okay. Go, 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 go. All right. Go. <laughs> I'll be with you. Yeah, what for your soul? <laughs> Yeah. Look at the good wife. But eh, I don't know why evil men like my brother end up marrying good wives. Why 
good men who end up marrying bad wives. Why is it like that? But as for me, I can't marry one. I can't marry. When I finally make it in this life, there's nothing that will make me to marry. Ta, not possible. I am too much one person to enjoy. What I need is like 15 baby mama. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. What you call? So, I'm too good now. Husband material. 15,000 years. Hey! Okay, better go. Where's the food? Well, uh, and you tell our beautiful wife, I've taken my time to ponder on everything. I've pondered on what you said. I've pondered on what your husband said. I have given everything very critical thought. And I have come to the conclusion that you are guilty of the allegation leveled against you by your husband. How? Who are you interrupting? Allow or no who to talk. Do you even know the man you are interrupting? Do you know who he is? Oh no, sorry for interrupting you. But I don't understand. How how am I guilty? You should be on your knees begging. If you continue like this, you will attract a huge fine. Fine. Ichi, I am sorry, but I still don't understand. I'm confused. How am I guilty from everything that has that that, that I've explained here? What we have decided as men, I'm communicating you now as your know, is that you have to go for that cleanse. Yes. That is the only way you can convince your husband that you are still that very decent woman he married. You have to submit yourself for the cleansing. Once you go for this cleansing, everything will be normal again. Very simple. Well, can I talk now? Uh -uh. Huh? What does you want to say? Listen. Do you all know who of Obodenu Kingdom has given a verdict? And that is final. You have absolutely nothing else to say. And that is, that's a tradition for goodness sake. But, but, but this is unfair. I did not do anything. I did not, I did not do anything. Well, as you know who of Obodenu, I have concluded this meeting and this meeting has ended. Uh, you may leave now. Oh no, this is unfair. My husband's. This is unfair. I did not do anything. That is what I'm saying. I did not do anything. It is my husband that cheated on me. Shut up! Shut up! Oh, simple instruction. Your stubbornness will never allow you to do something good in your life. You're interrupting a man that the God has constituted, who is the constitution of culture and tradition of this land, and he's speaking. Do you, do you think that we don't know who he's talking? He's the person talking. Yeah, it is the gods that are speaking through him. The gods can lie every other place. They don't lie here. The gods are wise. Yes. So you, we have, you are, the cleansing is the way forward. You have to submit yourself. This is the final verdict of your know who leave. Go and prepare for the cleansing. Prepare to be cleansed of what, Eloka? Of Ngongo na Ngongo, all the time na nyom. I did not do it. I, I did, did not uh, do it. I did not it. I have already ended this meeting. Leave. Ah. I'm happy that my brothers are seeing what I'm going through in my house. Go ahead and come. Yeah. This is what I see. You were told to leave. Leave. Stop leave. Just go. I don't huh? know. The script of stop on this is on the right side. to laugh on it. Go, 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 go. I did not do anything wrong. Uh, I did not do it. Prove it no, with no, the cleansing, huh? Prove it with the cleansing. You not do anything. Prove it with the cleansing. Simple. Cleanse me of what? Cleanse me of what? Of Ngo 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 Ngo. Ndam na nyong. You must be cleansed. Hello, man. Hello. Hey. I got a knowledge, I got a knowledge. 
we are just doing this for you. Yeah, of course. You have to be careful. Yes. Yeah. Uh, um, what the? Son of a king, a prince. Yes. I can never be found guilty in a court where the father is the judge. The chief judge. Yes. Uh -huh. You understand? Yes. He actually knows why we are doing this. That is just the thing. And he knows that we're doing it for him. That is it. Is there a You don't do it. I know you're waiting. You talk. You say you don't do it with the phone. You can't be serving. I said I don't return the phone. Why are you pardon now? Why you go return the phone? For me, say as you collect, we suppose sell them so that we go get something where we go use flanger. You carry return based on why now? What did they worry you? Now you collect the phone. Now your phone. No, see as you see as you the pardon for another person phone. What did they bring that one now? I got the well. I don't see. He be like, say, he get one thing, one thing where they play, well, I don't understand. He be like, say, don't they lie that guy? Don't they I am, I be? You don't they I am now? Oko dele. See, eh? If no be say, be my guy, one person, Bolola Suwaga, what did they bring that one now? Now, guy, they calm down. What do you mean, say, they like that girl? What do you mean, they stop that one now? Eh? What are they going to do with that small girl now? Out of which level? You don't know my spec again, I don't know my girlfriend. I like it very massive. Me and that girl, no girl, no girl. That man, unless girl, what do I want to do with her? I don't understand the way they behave now. Why you can't return the phone? Give oh, me? God, return the phone. Say, I know, I know one hold the phone again. I know one sell them. Now your phone. Now you collect them. No, me collect them. I can do with it whatever I wish. I return them back. Eh. Eh. Now, till they talk about that, I be. Bama, I bring my baby. I come off here. Yes, sir. $14,850. Yes. I'll give you my industry. We don't operate like that here, no. What do you mean by no? I said I'll give you my industry. They tell me no. You don't mind. What do they worry you? Boss, you are not going anywhere until you pay me my money. You're, You're not, not going anywhere? Yes. Until I pay your money? Yes. You'll be like, see, you got nothing with the finance from this money. I said I'll give you your money next week. And you don't get choice. You Boss, must take on that next week. I don't want anything X apart from my money. Pay me my money. Pay me my money. It's a bad thing. If I do go, you go block me back. You are not going anywhere. I don't tell me they go. Say the next week you collect your money. Do they worry you? Boss, you know they go anywhere till you pay me my money. That one has come. Bye. What did they worry you? What did they worry you now? You know you're waiting to talk. I'm deaf. Boss, all that here. I know they fear you. I, well, which one concern you concern this matter? Make you pay my money. You don't tell me. God, I know they fear you. Let me, let me this guy. They, they, you don't pay for me. Ah, I beg. Leave him. Leave him. Leave him. Leave him. Ah, I know, I know what I do. If I they go, make you homie. No, you don't chop, you don't chop belly food now. If I they go, if they burn you away, homie, or block my way. Boss, now nah, simple slush of this. You drink, you pay. Pay me my money. I say I go pay you next week. Which I be next and week? And next week you go collect the money. Me or Chidi, me will not give you one naira here till next week. And I saw you go pay. Boss, I know they tell you, you are not going anywhere. Oh, yeah, now. Nah. I don't they go. I say they go now, nah. block my way. If they, if they burn you away. Boss, you know they go anywhere. Pay me my money. Huh? I don't go anywhere. Uh, yes, pay me my money. Uh. So for your mind now, they block me. Uh, boss, I they block me. <laughs> 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 They said I am guilty. So I have to go for cleansing. 
Can you imagine? How? You're asking me. That is why I said they are wicked. I was the one who caught my husband cheating on me. Now I'm the one that has to go for cleansing. I don't understand. What kind of people are these? It's okay. You have to calm down first. Yeah. I don't know what I did wrong. I don't know what I did wrong, Gon Didi. Didi, I don't know what I did wrong, Ma Basi. I don't. Is it because I'm not from this state? No, 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 maybe because I be, I, I'm not from this state, that's why they are doing this to me. No, far from it. Um, this family is known for cheating in this town. And even the king's men support them, even when they, are, they know they are wrong. Why did I get married to this family? Why am I married to a family like this? I did not know now. I didn't know before I entered. Do I didn't know. No, no, no. Do not regret your marriage. Do not regret your marriage, please. Okay, what are you going to do? I don't know. Ma Basi, I don't know. I don't know what to do because I am confused. Because I did not do anything. I know. I caught my husband cheating and now I'm the one paying for it. I'm the one they are punishing. Is that how your people do? No, no. Look, you just have to put yourself together, okay? Put yourself together and then you look for a better way forward. Please. Everything will be fine. I know. You'll be okay. Hey, you'll be fine. Didi, I don't see anything being fine. Don't I don't up. see anything getting better. Don't give up. Don't give because up. Because I don't understand. I should, they should be begging me now. It should be the other way around. No. I was the one who saw a local with a girl. Now I'm the one being punished. I'm, I'm, I'm still trying to understand it. It's okay. You'll be okay. I know you're a strong woman. Uh, You'll be fine. Evil people, you people are not nice, so. Someone need to stand up. Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. Let's get in out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Bobo Denu. What is this world turning into, honey? Eh? Tell me, what is going on? Why are people, why are human beings wicked? Why, 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 why is it that human beings will see white and call it black, see black and call it red, see red and call it green? Why can't it, why, why can't, why, why can't we just see white and call it white? What is wrong with us? What is wrong? with us as, as a people. Why? Baby, are you okay? What happened? A lot has happened. A lot has happened today that has upset me. What is going on with people? You remember the case I told you about Eloka and the wife? Yes, baby. Would you believe that they judged that matter today? Uh, Would you believe they judged the matter today and found Eloka's wife, who is clearly innocent, guilty, and now she is being told to go for cleansing? Is that why you're this upset? Okay, listen. This is now a family affair. So it would be so wrong to, to, to hear that you're dabbling into people's family. Hey, oh no! Stop it! Stop it! That's where we get it wrong. Stop it! Stop it! It's a matter that affects everyone. It affects you. It affects me. Because injustice anywhere is injustice everywhere. Oh, you don't know? You should know. You should know. It's, it's all right. Eh? Let's call a spade a spade. Uh, why? Why would they tell that woman to go for cleansing? Why? No, but, but you know that she's innocent. You know the story. You know what happened. Yes, I do. I and I feel bad about it. But you're not the person that's supposed to tell them the truth. Why should it be my husband? Why must the person be my husband, baby? You see, you see this kind of thinking. 
is why we're where we are in this world right now. I'm telling you, everybody just feels it doesn't concern them. It's not their business. That's why you have high level of bullying, intimidation, and criminality in Obodenu because everyone just feels, oh, it, it's not my business. It's their family issue. Let them handle it. No. We're supposed to be our brother's keeper. You see something that is going wrong, you talk about it. I cannot stand back and watch people being maltreated and bullied in this community without talking about it. I am going to put it. Someone has to put a stop to it. Baby, please allow Obodenu happening. Remain with them. Okay, you don't have to be the one to front. Why, why not? No, why not? Why can I not be the one to talk about it? You know me, you know how I'm wired. You know that I cannot stand back and watch someone being intimidated or someone be, be, being maltreated. I cannot take it. It's not right. Because injustice anywhere. is injustice everywhere. Baby, I, I, I don't want to lose my husband. Please. I, 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 you are not going to lose me. Nothing is going to happen to me. I just want you to have it at the back of your mind that injustice anywhere is injustice everywhere. It doesn't affect you today. One day it might affect you. You see injustice anywhere, you fight it. Fight it to a standstill. This is injustice, yo. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, yo. Where are the truth sayers now? Where are the upright men now? Obodaya Sakwano. I I say where are the truth sayers now? Kedebendezi okunozi. I alowe menu. I mini maloni si kedo kandi daya gatizi. My husband, welcome. Hey, 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 keep your greeting to yourself. I don't need it. Even if you don't need it, I will greet you. You're my husband. You ceased to be my wife from the day you cheated on me. Okay? Hey, look, why are you like this? Hey, look, why are you this artless? You know deep down in your heart that I did not cheat on you. Why are you doing this? Then go for the cleansing and prove your innocence. Go for cleansing and cleanse what? Cleanse of immorality. Immorality. Sexual immorality in case you don't understand. Is it a big deal? Why do you must to do it? M-U-S-T. Capital letter. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Then you have to force me, Luca. Really? You will have to force me for that cleansing. Now, let me make something clear to you. If I wait for you for three days, I mean three days from today, and you don't go for that cleansing, I will be forced to return your bride price and take another wife. Chicken. <laughs> That's if my people will listen to you. They will see me in court then. Oh, yes. They will meet me in court. You will go to court. Mm -hmm. Hey, look, when you get to court, what, what, what will you tell them that I did to you? I see. No, what would be your case? You still need to understand how far I am willing to go to make sure that you're punished. You don't know that. Don't worry. What kind of wicked man did I marry? He knows I did not do it. What is going like? I'm beginning to question my own sanity. I did not do this, Eloka, and you know it. Why are you being so wicked and heartless? Eloka, why are you letting the devil use you now? Why are you letting the devil use you to destroy your own home by yourself? What is this? This is wickedness. Ha! Hmm. Babe, you sounded so angrily over the phone. Why? That's because I have no reason to be friendly with you. Babe, why are you doing this? I, I don't understand. How do you mean? Oh. Since you want me to say it to you, why did you beat Amaka and took her phone? She insulted me. How? See, can we forget about this girl? and discuss about ourselves. No, I called you to the shop so we can talk about this. I'm listening. Okay. The thing is that she did not greet me. And when I confronted her, 
she started insulting me. Oh I got angry and I hit her. Oh my God, you hit a woman? You did that? See, don't take it that way. Okay? That's not, that's not what I mean. But you just said it yourself. How could you hit a woman because she refused to greet you? Babe, if you want a basket full of greeting, I am ready to give it to you on a daily basis. Eh? You just beat someone because she refused to greet you. See, the thing that happened was a transfer of aggression. Yes, I was already angry. Then it was a mistake that she came into the picture. Oh, she came into the picture, so you beat her. Huh? You know what? You apologize to her. Is it? You heard me. You apologize to her. You go and apologize. I'll do no such thing. Sorry. <laughs> you better do that. You need to go and apologize. If not, you won't like what is coming for you. Is that a threat or what? It's not. You need to do the right thing. My husband, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Annette. How are you? I'm fine. I hope there's no problem. Oh, there's no problem. Where is that useless husband? Uh-huh. Why are you trusting my name as if I owe you? You owe me everything. I can't remember transacting any business with you, so how do I owe you? You owe me the debt of taking good care of this wonderful woman you call wife. Hey, look at what is happening. Eh? What do you stand to gain by treating her? Ah. You have gone to report me, Abby? No, you've gone to call your police. Police officer. No, IG of police. That's what you brought. Hey, look at What is wrong with you? I did not report you to anyone. Obviously, people are watching you. People are watching you, they see what you do to me, they see it! Oh yes, she did not report it to me. But the news of your infidelity, the news of the way you treat your wife, is already in the lips of everyone in Obodin. Iruka, why? Why are you doing this? I'm also asking you, what are you doing here? What do you stand to gain? Poking your nose in what does not concern you. This is a family affair. Allow me to handle it my own way. Hey, Luca, I will show you that she's equally my wife. But I will not allow you to treat her before me. I'm giving you five days. Five days to take her in. Else, let me ask you. I want to get something very clear. In Alamunem. Yes, because I need to know. I need to know why you are applying all this energy, so much force. Eh? What do you want to do if I refuse to take her in? What will you do? Iloka, if not that you're my younger brother, I know what I'll do to you. <laughs> but that five days stands. Listen, you don't have to wait five for five days. You don't have to wait for five days. Bring it on. I'm waiting for you. Bring it on. I'm waiting for you. I'm off here. All I want is money. No, you sneaked in because you didn't know I was around. If I wasn't around now, don't, don't start here. Uh, yes. If I wasn't around now, maybe you would have gone into my matrimonial bed and continued from where you stopped before. Now, listen, let me tell you something for free. No matter how far you try to blackmail me, it will not stop you from going for that cleansing. You must go for that cleansing. You don't hear your nonsense. I'm going to bring your boyfriend. I'm going to attack them. Oh, so babe, when is it coming for the wine carrying? Next year. Ah, that's three months from now. Yes. <laughs> this is so good. At least we have time to be back. I'm telling you. So, how did your discussion with your boyfriend go? My dear, it went well. At least he has returned the front one. 
He lied to you. As a matter of fact, on my way to your shop, I met Amaka. And she said he hasn't returned the phone. No. No. He gave the phone to his brother's wife, Norma, to return to Amaka. Okay, unless that. Bochi, I'll keep asking you, what are you doing with that rascal? That guy does not fit you. Babe, you know I love him. And that's why I'm with him. Hmm? Bochi, you deserve better. You deserve better. Forget about this guy and move on. Chooks is ready to marry you. It's just for you to say yes and you will be his wife. <laughs> Even if there is no man, like nobody in this world, you and I know that I cannot marry Chooks. Why? He's a yellow boy. Yeah. So you believe all the rumors going around about him in this village? It's not rumor. It's a fact. The truth. Do you have evidence to prove that his money is not genuine? That question should be for him. You need to ask him if his money is genuine. Ha. I can't ask him that question. I can't go and ask him, ah, Chooks, is your, man, is, is your money genuine? No, no. I can't do that. Then stop bringing this topic into our discussion. Please. I'm telling you because my, you're my friend and I like you. Whatever. What do you have? I'm tested. I'm tired. Won't you even give me something? I'm tired. Ah. <laughs> please, please go and tell me something. Just think so you have a problem. Leave me. Uh, if we all keep quiet, then the situation just rottens up. We'll have a failed state. What is the level of criminality happening in Obodenu right now is a reflection of what's happening on the national level. You can see it yourself. Okay, okay. imagine what just happened at the last concluded elections. We, we know, we saw proof that candidate A won, but the electoral body decided to go against clear evidence and crowned candidate B winner of the elections. Now, that's not even my problem. My problem is the reaction of the people who saw that level of criminality, who saw what had happened. Their reaction, how docile and passive they chose to be under such level of stinking criminality. Please. That is what upsets me. And I'm not wired like that. Please relax. No, I'm not stressing. I, I, I just, I'm just wired you know, when I see, when I, when I, when I see justice, I talk about it. Young man, how are you? I'm not fine, sir. I think I know who you are. Yeah, yeah. The young man that has um, a beer parlor down the road. Yes, sir. We're not fighting now, are we? Why would you say you're not fine? Your brother fought me. I broke my nose. Why? What happened? Came okay, with his friend to drink in my bar. When it was time for the payment, he said, let it be next week. He didn't tell me his plan was to drink on credit. And I refused. I refused to let him go until he paid my money. Then he nodded my nose with his head and broke my bottles. I, I, I hope the injury is not that terrible. It is, but I've treated it. How much is um, the money for this for you? 40,850. How is that even possible? That's like three cartons of beer. As he was drinking, he was buying for other people. Hoping that he will pay me my money. It's okay, young man. I've heard you. First and foremost, I want to apologize for what has happened. I'm really sorry. Okay? Um, give me to the end of this week. I promise I'm going to do something about it. Please. Okay, sir. Just make sure you take your injection of the trust, whichever one you want to join. Okay, ma'am.
This is HD, man. This is HD, man. You have seen the kind of embarrassment your boyfriend is bringing to this family. Baby, please. Let's go inside and please. Why do you want to talk about it in the dark? Why can we not talk about it here? Oh no, he's your boyfriend. We're going to talk about it here. What do you have to say? I'm listening. You sounded so desperate on the phone. What is the matter? You see, Bandaka, Madoka is making things very difficult for me. Madoka. How do you mean? Imagine Madoka came to my house, threatening me to go and apologize to my wife. If not, he will take the matter up. That I must apologize to her and take her in. Madoka. Huh? No. What is his interest in this matter? Eh? No, is he into your wife? Is he? Ah, ma'am. I don't even know what to say. In fact, I want him completely off my neck. Okay, just uh, you have to take things easy. Yeah? You have to take it easy. Take it easy. And he's gaining more grounds. See, it's your You know Madoka better than I do. Eh? So help me. I need him off my neck. Don't worry, I will talk to him. Eh? I will talk to him and he will stay off your trail. Ah, what is wrong with Madoka? Ha! Imagine. Madoka is compelling me to apologize to my wife. Eh? And me, me. And me, me. How can that be? It's not possible. Don't worry, I will talk with him. By the time I've spoken with him, I know he will listen to me. If he doesn't, <laughs> yeah, yeah, <I'm> <laughs> uh. Baby, with the way your brother is going, I think sending him abroad is the best option. Listen, if he detailed you to come have this conversation with me, stop it. I'm no longer enjoying this discussion. Stop it. I'm not enjoying it. Oh, you know he did not, and he cannot ask me to. I am just concerned with the way he's behaving. He's constituting nuisance. No, my that boy is my little brother. Is my responsibility, and I'm not going to give to him what he wants when I know clearly that it's going to ruin him. Honey, please, can you reconsider this? The more we keep lingering on this, the more he will keep painting you black, and one day he will end up in jail. He's better in jail in Nigeria than in jail abroad. Yes. Very soon, people will start saying, I am the reason you, you've not sent him abroad. What kind of talk is that? Why would any right, good thinking person say that? I don't say because he's not my brother. That's why I stopped you. And it's not fair. Okay, the question is Did you stop me from sending him abroad? I have not been. But I won't be there to, to, to defend myself when they're discussing this outside. And secondly, you've sent my brother abroad and I, I just... Listen to me. Don't even, don't talk about your brother right now. They, they don't belong to the same league. Remember, remember that your brother had completed about 70 to 80 percent of his travel plans. All I did was just come into the picture and just smoothing it up for him. He has his eyes set on his goals. He's abroad right now. He's studying. Huh? And you're talking about H.E.D. Me that has not even settled down to write his O-level exams. You want him to go abroad and get lost? Please, don't insult your brother by comparing him to H.E.D. Me. Don't do that. Don't do that. Baby, I'm just, I'm just concerned about what people say. Just I'm worried about what people will say. Everyone will be all right, including H.E.D. Me. Huh? Leave him alone. Let him keep jumping around. Very soon he's going to get tired of wanting to go abroad and he would come back and join me business. I know this kind. Someone need to stand up, someone need to rise, someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand, our women are no slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Hey, our women are no 
Sorry for that. Just that I was waiting for my husband to go out before coming. Are you a he? Yeah, I am. Come on, come <laughs> on. <laughs> <laughs> so I I want to understand that to me. We are spending the night here together. Oh no, not today. Why? Because my husband will be coming back. But I thought you told me that he's a night chief. Yes, that's what he said. But the church have employed more security to relieve him of his night duty. He'll be coming back. We're too many stories. I don't think we need a lot of stories. Come on, just go to the Oh, room. chief, calm down. Calm down. I don't why? Uh, yes, you need to calm down because I've not seen the money you promised me. How about the money? Why are you talking about money? <laughs> you know I'm going to wire the money to you. It's not supposed to be a problem. Uh, wow. <laughs> Still be coming down, you know? Now the money is involved. I think I'm more in yes. <laughs> Oh, I like the side of that. So that we I calm down. I'm here. Yeah, I'm for you. And I, I, I pray you should just give me time to freshen up for you. I'm so. going to allow you to freshen up. <laughs> <laughs> you will freshen up okay. and, then, and then you will freshen up. Wait, uh, what exactly do you intend to gain from all this? I don't understand the question. You don't understand what I said? Hey, Loka is already seeing you as a pain in his neck. And I don't care. I will never stop until the right thing is done. Madoka, I'll advise you to solve Peter. This is a family matter and our wife cannot win over us. No way. It's your pity. This draconian rule that our wives can't win over us has no place in modern civilization. Yes. <laughs> it's a pity. If we want to be right always, let us learn. I mean, our family supposed to learn how to do things the right way. <laughs> What's okay? Don't Wait. you understand? Are you now challenging Dumona? No, are you now challenging Dumona? Let me ask you, if we call an enlarged meeting of the woman, can you stand before the young men who are enjoying this rule to say this? You call this enjoyment? You call it enjoyment? Listen, it's your pity. Huh? I, Madoka, have no business with lies. Let me ask you, if your daughter is treated this way, Will you be happy? Answer me. <laughs> Madoka the Great Crusader. <laughs> Look at him. No, Madoka the Great Crusader. You forget that in our family, all of us are guilty of infidelity. Even you. I have your data, you know. I have your data. <laughs> oh, Madoka. Let Eloka handle his family affairs his own way. Please, let him be. How can I? Do you want to blackmail me now? How can I blackmail you? <laughs> you know, I can't do that. I'm not a blackmailer. Uh, provided you do not push me to the wall. Let Eloka be. Anyways, I... I will soft pedal. But Eloka has to do the right thing. I mean, let him allow the woman into the house. Yes, that woman is suffering. She takes her bath once in a day and only in the middle night, in the open. It is beginning to affect her health. Let him do the needful. Come. Is Anita your girlfriend? No, because you are beginning to sound like someone who has an uh, ulterior and uh, uh, unveiled 
vested, sorry, veiled vested interest. Yes, because you you sound like someone who is, eh? Wait, wait are you are you are you are you why why are you so much interested in this? Itchy appetite. Hmm? Itchy appetite. Hmm? You baffle me. I mean, why can't you see these things from my own perspective? Eloka is dehumanizing that pretty woman, and I'm not happy about it at all. Wait, you still sound like somebody who who goes behind the looker to do some me. I mean, no, do you do that? You know I can't try such. So why are you sound like this? But uh, of course, yeah, I know you. <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> yeah. Go and drop me uh, the marketplace and uh, let me go. Look at you. You know, uh, righteous, righteous. If not that. that you're my elder brother, uh, I, I will not allow you to enter this vehicle. Wait, uh, after saying all this, okay, I will not call it rubbish. After saying all this. This is injustice. Oh. How can I pay for a sin I never commit? Oh. Hey, this is injustice. Oh. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh. Where are the truth sayers? Oh my big two. I don't understand. Nice boss. Hey, Jimmy. Do you want to run? I've seen you already. Can I be in there? Where are you going? You have seen me. Uh huh. Uh huh. What will you do? No, tell me now. What will you do? Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Jimmy. Balu no we go lo. Huh? Bahalo we go lo. Be useful to yourself. Yourself. Even if you choose not to be useful to the people around you, be useful to yourself. Make something out of your life, Hey, Jimmy. Why are you going around this town constituting nuisance? Why are you bent on dragging? The name of our family through the mud. Organi Who? How did we offend you? Eh? I'm asking you. You know why? You know why? So stop asking me. I don't know. Send me abroad. If I can go, send me abroad so that we stop posting in dance. Hi. One day more. My brother, your sense of entitlement saddens me. Do you know that at your age, hmm? at your age, if I had wanted to travel abroad, I already made the money when I was your age. Dear one, story for the course. You know, man, Jesus, you are lying. HD, man. You're not going to hoodwink me into wasting my resources on your very stupid ideas. See, you get what I don't understand. Some people are very wicked. Why are you wicked? Why are you very wicked? You were able to send your brother-in-law abroad, but you cannot do the same for your brother. Why? No, actually, you're not good to go abroad now. I'm not good to go abroad, that's why. Listen to me. I don't know who you are, but this will be the last time you will interfere in my discussion with my brother. Why are you shutting him up? No, tell me, Fekego, why are you shutting him up? Because you know he's telling you the truth. What truth do you want to hear? That you want to compare yourself to my brother-in-law who had wrapped up his BSc here in this country, has his eyes on his goals and currently studying abroad, doing his masters. Is that the truth you want to hear, Ichidima? I don't care. You don't? I don't care. If I can go, I don't care. You know, sometimes I wonder if actually you are my brother. No, because the way you treat me, if I can go, the way you treat me, you don't treat me as if me and you are related in any way. Mano Joka, I thought I give me. Mano Subadro, there's no problem. You think I care how you feel? I'm not here now. I don't care because I have given you the best. I am doing the best a brother can do for you. I told you, come and join me in business. 
so that you can grow, so that you can be head and shoulders above your peers. You refuse. And I equally told you that my destiny is not in this country. Bam! So send me abroad. Abroad, that's all I'm saw. Abroad, that's all I'm saw. If you can go, send me abroad. Now, why you know, tell your brother-in-law to join you for business, oh. then send a GD man abroad. God bless you. Why didn't you do that? Open the link. God bless you. Ask him. Tell your brother-in-law to, to come back to Nigeria, join you in business, and he stays abroad. It, it, it's fair. Don't mind him. Blackie. Why do you want to go to jail? Why do you want me to arrest you? One more word from you will send you to jail. One more word. H E D man. You are you are going to go to that bar and clear your debt. You're going to pay for all that you drank, all that you ate with your friends. Uh, because this time, I'll not be cleaning your mess. Go there and settle that young man. If you stop go. embarrassing yourself. I never asked you to pay for me. If you can go, I can pay for my bill. Mm -hmm. Send me abroad. That's what I'm asking. Simple. Look at look at this wicked man. Very wicked and heartless. What are you, you saying? You call yourself my, my brother. You 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 for me with, with your money. Send me abroad. That I can what, pay for my beer. That is what they do. You Very see, wicked human being. Calm and wicked. I'm He's now I'm very wicked. I don't know what, what kind of combination is that. Wicked combination. People see Martin is a very good one. Chidi. HDMA is going from bad to worse. Honestly. I don't know what is his problem. There's nothing I've not done to make him become responsible. I appreciate your effort, Jay. But you still have to try more. Please. I'm tired of all this. Like, babe, look at me. At this stage, I'm supposed to be talking about marriage. But it's not looking towards that direction. You don't have to be tired. Just keep trying. Keep trying more, please. Please. Because right now we are not giving up on him. There is no going back. I know. Yeah. But I think the stubbornness is not ordinary. How do you mean? Babe, I don't know how to explain this. But. Look at him carefully. Look him. Maybe you'll be able to know what I'm talking about. Okay. I'll look into it. But then still, still on still, keep trying, please. Yeah. I'll keep trying. I love him. So, I'm not giving up on him. That settles it then. You keep fighting for what you want and what you love from your own end. And I'll keep fighting for him from my own end. Thank you. You're welcome. So please, <laughs> drink your juice. Obozinke talisiansino eselebeu. This is injustice. Enu na na manaka mo diacha o. How can I pay for a sin I never committed? Hey, this is injustice. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey yo, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? No, Obodaya Sakwano. I, I say, where are the truth sayers? No, Kedebendezi Okunozi. I, I know a man. No, I, Mini Maloni. See, 
kedo kandi daya gatizi o kwandi si opoto o kwa fana ibuzi anyo mana kini kange mazio onye yekulumo kedo nye asala mokuno obozin keta lisiansana eselebe this is injustice oh my friend please stop crying no matter how long you cry whether you want to cry from now to eternity it will not change anything please I did not do anything. I did nothing wrong. I don't know what I did wrong to deserve this, Norma. You did nothing wrong. I don't know what I did to deserve this. You did nothing. From all indications and from the story you just told me, it is crystal clear that your husband is guilty and you're innocent. So I don't see anything wrong with what you did. You did nothing wrong. Please. You know what breaks my heart the most? The fact that his kinsmen took sides with him. <sighs> they know the truth, yet they are siding him. They know he's lying. But they are accusing me of being guilty. So I don't understand. Why am I not surprised? I mean, I'm not surprised. It is very normal for the men of Obodenu to behave the way they're behaving. Normal. No, I swear, if I had known this is how I would be treated in this marriage, I wouldn't have married Eloka. I wouldn't have walked into this marriage with him. I wish I had seen the future. I wish. <sighs> it's okay, my friend. This is no time for regrets. The bone of contention now is, what are your intentions? What do you intend to do? Mom, I don't know. I don't know because I'm confused. I don't want to go for the cleansing. I, I... I have this feeling that it's going to affect me in a negative way. I, I, I don't want to go ahead with it. I, I don't want to do it. You're right. There is no woman in this community who has gone through that cleansing process that remained the same. So you're totally right. <clears throat> oh, goodness God. And that is what they want me to go through. And they want me, to, they want me to go through her. God. God. Ah, Obasi. What have I done to deserve this? This is not fair. It's okay. This is not fair in any way. This is not fair. All I did was get married to an evil man. I did not do anything wrong. Hey. Ah, it's okay, yeah, my me. friend. It's yeah, okay. Me. Please. It's okay. I know my God will vindicate you. That is certain. It's okay. Father, as you can see, our reps uh, sand is already finished and uh, the sand too. It's just remaining one trip. So we need more blocks and more sand so that the worker can actually continue the building. Engineer, I can see you have a very good job here. Yeah. 
you are doing well. I'm, I'm, I'm happy about that. Thank you. Uh, what you are just requesting, definitely we are going to provide that for you. Uh, but you need to put more effort, sure, sure. bring in more people, so I that know. we can uh, very soon we can have here. When I get to the parish, okay. I'll make a transfer. Wow. Huh? I'll make a transfer. Definitely, I'm going to make a transfer today. Thank you, Father. Okay. Thank you, Father. Because, um, go back to work. Okay. Thank you. I'll it up. I'll be expecting to hear from you. Thank you very much. Greetings, Father. <laughs> thank you, my dear. How are you? I'm fine, sir. I can see you're going to the church. Yes, Father. Ah. Right, let me drop you. This is injustice. A judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? Lord, oh, I say, where are the truth sayers? Kedeben desio kunozi. I, I know where men are. Kedo kandi daya gatizi, o kwandi si o koto, o kwafane ibuzi anyo, managi ni kange masio, onye yekulumu, kedo nye asala. How can call someone convince me that this man is not going down with my wife? How? God, what is this? Huh? No, did I borrow money from this man to marry my wife? What's wrong with it? You never heard that. You hear from me. Hey, this is injustice. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? Oh, God, I ask one Ah, my husband, what is going on here? Why is my, my, my back? The thing that is going on here is that you are going to the parish house to live with your reverend father. What are you talking about? I don't understand it. I don't have time for necessary arguments. Just pack your things and go. How? How can you just wake up one morning and ask me to leave the house? What have I done wrong? Think I'm a fool? No, wait. Do you think I am stupid? Huh? My husband, you're confusing me here now. What, what is the problem? What have I done? What have I done? Just what happened is that you are sleeping with your parish priest. My own wife, Okamaka, is sleeping with the Reverend Father in their church. That is the problem, and I cannot take it. Pack your things and leave here. Holy Mary. Bernard. This has nothing to do with holy anybody. You do hear what I said? Now move this is or I move you. Now, that's a blasphemy against the man of God. Bernard, I want you to withdraw it now. I guess you think I'm playing, right? Where are the upright men, Lord? I say, where are the truth sayers? I say, where are the truth sayers? I Kedo kandi daya gatizi O kwandi si o koto O kwafane ibuzi anyo Managini kange mazio Onye ye kulumu Kedo nye Calm down and tell us exactly what he did If a kego came here to challenge me He won't believe this Listen, listen, listen He was talking just around nonsense And I decided to abandon him to go back to what I was doing before he called me to say he was coming. Could you believe that I was, as, as I was leaving, he held my hand and dragged me back. You would have seen his face like a condemned criminal. How? Oh, oh no. I ask you, why? How can you make such devastating decision against an innocent woman? Oh no. What is your interest in all of this? No special interest, oh no. I'm just asking that the right thing be done. No, no, are you not saying that we are wrong in the decision we took against a woman who blatantly cheated on her husband? Oh no, on this matter you are not just wrong, but you. 
the decision you have made is devilish and can push someone to committing suicide. Oh no. Where is your heart? Where is your humanity? Oh no. You know what, if I can go, I was actually busy upstairs when you came. I came down to give you all DNs as a brother, but from all indications, you have nothing important to say. You can find your way out when you want to leave. Uh, oh no, oh no, oh no, please. Uh, come on. Oh no, please. You, 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 can't, you, you can't leave. Uh, we're, we're, we're yet to, 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 to come to an agreement on this matter. We're, we're yet to make a decision. What is wrong with you, Fekegu? Why will you grab my hand? Are you, are you mad? Maybe I am mad. Oh no. Mad. Mad. I am mad. By asking that the right thing be done, I, I am losing my mind. Let me ask you. Oh no, if Anietia were to be your daughter, would you support this devilish and wicked decision against her? You know, you are beginning to overstep your boundary. And I will not hesitate to deal with you. Oh no, let me tell you. As long as I am alive, I am not going to allow that decision against an innocent woman stand. I am going to fight you until justice is served. You have just declared war on the men of Obodeno. If I am asking you, are you ready? If a man of Obodeno choose to wake up and call white black, then I will take it upon myself to make them know that white is white and cannot be called anything else. You are Yonu. You are a custodian of our culture and tradition. You are the royal prime minister of Obodenu. Oh no, will speak the truth. Speak the truth. Have a heart. Have a heart. What if she was in blood? Would this be your position? Have a heart. If a go is surely biting more than he can chew. Can you be that? Wait, wait, Steve. Are you saying that Ife Kego blocked your way? No, he did not just block me. He held my hand and was looking very fierce and very tense. If not because I decided to play along, he would have hit me. Eh? Yes. He has never stepped his bounds. No, this time he should be dealt with decisively. Uh, uh, hey, look at him. Calm down. Hmm? This is not a matter of physical combat. No, that's exactly what he needs right now. Somebody needs to teach him sense. This is getting too much. Can you imagine? The other time he came to my house, challenging me over what does not concern him. And now, he has the guts to enter this place and challenge our own family chief. No, he will get on my Hey, look, I calm down. Hmm? Let me handle this my own way. Rapia. Hey, hey, you see, Apite, please, I am interested. I want to know exactly how do you intend to handle this your own way? I'm saying, let me handle it my own way. Just trust me. Yeah? <laughs> okay. 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 I trust you. But I tell you, if this repeats itself, if this ever repeats itself, it will end in the most violent way. What nonsense! I'm very vulgar now, man. It's not something you can get into fisticuffs. If I get you, you know, you know, I've seen his face. How he was, how he was vibrating as if he's the owner of of, of, of this attack. Can you imagine the gods? Oh, because of what did they like? To stand up, someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. It's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Have you seen? Have you seen? Have you seen? Have you Have all gone mad? This man have all gone mad, but I'll be the one man to stand up to them and cure them of that madness. Baby, what happened? You will not believe what I saw today. Bernard was beating the wife up. Not, not just that, he was pulling, dragging the innocent woman on the floor. Why would he do that to his wife? The answer to that question would make you realize how mad these men have gone. 
Brothers is accusing the wife of sleeping with the Reverend Father. Huh? Beat that. Why such allegations? Madness. Madness. These men have gone mad. But I'm going to put an end to that madness. Ndiala. I told you never to call me in the middle of the night. You know that is the only time I have for my family. I was with my wife the time you called. Why now? Why? Well, something came up. That was why I was calling. What happened? I am pregnant. What? How? What kind of question is that? Of course you know you like it, Ross. So are you even supposed to be asking me this kind of question? Kechi. Raw or no raw, it is for our enjoyment. I enjoyed it. You enjoyed it too. So why, why, why must you allow yourself to get pregnant? Okay. What do you want us to do about it? What do you mean, what do you want us? Of course, I'm keeping this pregnancy. Hmm. Uh -huh. I'm keeping it. Just say that. Yes, I just said it. And I'm very serious about it. This is injustice. I'm here for my wife. Where is my wife? Bernard, I'm not your wife's keeper. I don't understand what you're doing here. I left my wife with you in the afternoon. See now she's not back home. What's it by the time? I thought you had something important to talk about. My wife's affair is not important to you, right? No, it's not important to you. It's okay, go. By the time the entire village will gather for you and I in this community, you let them know where you left my wife. I'll be waiting. What is it talking about? My wife is in church. My wife is in church. I dropped her up at the church. You see, the other day, the saw there was beating the woman up. When he was done beating her up, he left her by the side of the room. So I just you know, put her in the car and took her to the church. Seriously? I'm telling you. I didn't give him that information because I didn't. I don't want him to go to that church and start harassing the woman. This man, I'm mad. Now I know that the men in this community are actually mad. Mad at Greg Kobe. They're all raving mad. Hey, Let's go inside. My in laws, you're welcome. Why not come in and take a seat? At least I can offer you something. Give us one reason why you want us to go inside your house. Ah, you know my in-laws. You're my in-laws, of course. We're not here for this argument. Where's our daughter? Uh, she went out. Where did she go? Um, I, I wouldn't know, but she went out. So... so it's true? I don't understand. You don't understand? You sent our daughter away just because she went to church. Eh? Who is telling you all this and that? I, I, I didn't send her anywhere. Then where is she? Like I've already told you, that she went out. She might even be back any moment. Let me tell you, you can try this nonsense with every other lady, but not with our daughter. If we come back here tomorrow and she's not back in this house, you will know that she came from somewhere. Let's go. Let us go. Look at the kind of problem this Reverend Father created for me. Huh? How, how, where on earth am I going to find this woman? 
I was only joking when I asked her to leave the house. I, I didn't take it to her. I didn't take it serious. How else am I going to find her for crying out loud? Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us. They don't even care. Who's gonna speak for us? Hello. Who's Good afternoon, Mom. How are you? I'm fine, Mom. Um, so, how much is it you said my brother-in-law drank from the shop? 40,000 plus. Let me just check the debtor book to confirm the amount. Oh, you don't have to, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Um, a second. So, this is, um, 15,000 naira. Wow. Thank you so much, Ma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm grateful. You can keep the change. Oh, thank you, Ma. Thank you, Ma. You're God bless you, Ma. So, that settles it, right? Yes, yes, Ma. Have a nice day. Oh, my greetings to your husband. Ah, wow. What a nice woman. God will continue to bless her. Ah. Thank God, Ma. Father, I want to go back to my parents' house. All my life, I've never been humiliated. And I can't take it from any man. I cannot. He is not just any man. He is your husband. You crossed the line the very first day you let me publicly. Get out! 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 What is it? What is the problem? Can you imagine this stupid woman? Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? It has not come to that yet. Calm down. Don't, don't call your wife names. Don't record it. What? What? No, what do you expect me to do? A titty woman? Mm -hmm. A titty wife? That's not true, sir. That's not true. If I, 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 I will true. tell you if, 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 if talk any further. Well, I'm, I'm here. Respect me now. Eh? I'm standing in front of you. And you still want to hit your wife. It's not fair. What, what did you say she did again? This woman has been cheating on me. She has been cheating on me. It's a lie. Okay. I've not done that before. Can, can you prove it? Do you have proof? I have more than enough evidence. Okay. Enough! I have more than enough! Can I see it? In, in whatever form, let, let me see the proof you have. You think, Ego, countless times I have caught this woman frolicking with the Reverend Father. Countless times! Hey, Bernard, Bernard, come on now. That, that's blasphemy. Now, the Reverend Father is a man of God. You cannot, you cannot, you cannot say that. Look at this young man. It's not possible. What are you saying? Huh? I think I made a mistake talking to you. Please get out of my way. Hey, hey, hey. Stop. Now. Stop. Relax. I'm trying to talk. talk get out of my way, young man. Calm down. I'm standing here. You want what? You want what? You want to go through me? Relax. Now, what is even wrong with you? This is my family affair. It's not for business. I don't care. I'm a man of Obodenu. And I'm telling you to calm down. She's a woman married to, into this land. And it's my job to protect her. Calm down. What okay, calm down? Calm more down. What's even wrong with you people? You people think that, okay, it's about muscles and all. You want to intimidate your wife. Can I get him If you go. Okay, I can see that you're interested in this woman. You, you, that's, you can have her all to yourself. I'm interested in your wife. You can have her. Keep her. You! You! Take that as part of marriage. Do not see it as humiliation. Father, this same man was the man who accused you of sleeping with me. I expected you to be mad at him and not the other way around. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. That is our Lord's prayer. Your husband reacted as human and I'm not going to hold it against him. Father, if I should go back to that house, he will continue to treat me like an animal. Yes. So the best thing for me to do is to go back to my people. What next after returning to your people? Are you going to remarry? I've never thought of that. I just remain in my parents' house peacefully. As long as I can. There is no godly decision on that. You go back to your husband. While we remain in prayers. I am I of the belief that your husband will realize he has accused you wrongly. That is the best thing for you to do. I'm not sure that's the best thing for me to do. You have to do it. Do it for God. Yes, don't come. Thank you. You're going to see me. Yes, he's a husband around. No, he's not. Why are you looking around? What is it? Uh, news has it that he has made arrangements to marry a second wife. What? 
out. Did you stop people? What, 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 what kind of um, rumor is that one? Why are you lying? I won't leave my place and tell you to come and tell you this if it's not true. Did you wait? Do you mean my husband is trying to take another wife? Yes, he's everywhere in the village. Everybody's talking about it. Luka, why are you like this? What kind of man is this? Why, 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 why? Did you... Polygamy and treating women bad wrongs in their family. You have to do something to stop this thing from happening. Titi, what do you advise I do? What do I do? Hey, what, in, what, what do I do? At this point, you have to take the cleansing. No, you did not just say that. Didi, what are you talking about? What just came out of your mouth? Yes, I did. You have to stop him from taking a second wife. Titi, how can you even advise me to go for the cleansing? What did I do? I am innocent. What am I getting cleansed of? I did not do anything. I know you did not do anything. But you have to take a step to save your marriage. Or do you want another woman to come and take your marriage? Is that what you want? This is injustice. I in Nanakamo, dear Joe. How can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, this is injustice. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, you didn't tell me you were going out. Ah, babe, it came as an emergency. Okay. So where did you go? I went to play the barman. Why? What for? Babe, he's been threatened that he will involve the police if we don't. And I don't want trouble. And in the event that that happens, will you be the one the police will arrest? I don't see it that way. Maybe you should tell me how I see it. Baby, see, we are not supposed to be arguing on everything that happens in this family. Okay, I have paid debts with my own money and there's no cause for alarm. I don't like this. This is the reason that you didn't continues to be irresponsible. I don't like this. What you've just done is, is, is why he is the way he is. How do you know? He keeps messing around because he knows that someone would come around to clean his mess. Keep praying for him. Hopefully, he's going to change. He's not a boy. He's not a boy. This is not about prayers right now. He's meant to become responsible. He's a man now. Let 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 him begin to live and deal with the consequences of, of his actions. This is a bit upsetting. I don't like it. How can how can Echidime be a nuisance to himself? And, and everyone around him, and then you keep cleaning up his mess. What is wrong with you, baby? What, do you not see that that boy is irresponsible? What, you, what, you don't see it? Are you hungry? Now she talks about food. Please, don't, don't, don't do that. Don't try to change the subject here. What you've just done is, to you might be right, but and I don't see it as a way forward, Virginia. It's over between us. Hmm? I don't understand what you mean by that. I mean, I'm done with you. No, no, Uchi, you can't do that now. It's already done. Huh? It's already done. How could you go to a bar and drink without money? Who is telling you that? Forget who told me. How could you do that? 
The bartender asked you for his money and you fought with him. Come on, that was gross. He pushed me beyond limit. No, what do you expect me to do? To lay last and watch him insult me? No, now. See, I'm, I'm done with all your excuses. I am done. Please leave. Hey, G, 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 you can't do that to me now. You can't do that. See, if you leave me, I will die. You. <laughs> yeah? you see, I'm not caught out for your cheap emotional blackmail. If you die, I, Chioma, will gladly attend your burial and take some free drinks and free rice. Wait, are you wishing me dead? You wished yourself first, so I okayed it. Okay, okay, Chi. You know what? No more fighting, no more fomenting trouble, please. Can you remember how many times you've made those promises? Forget about how many times I made the promises to you. Just take my word this time. Eh? Believe me. Mm. No. Leave my shop. I'll push you. Leave my shop! Leave my shop! Leave! What's that? I will not have peace again. Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up. And add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Over the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. So our women are over the noon, I, I, we men are not slaves. So we men are not slaves. Great eyes full of tears. Go ben, I don't have to know. Afternoon, Kedo. Please, I'm looking for my wife. This is my wife. Who's your wife? Any problem? There's no problem. There's no problem. Thank you. Yeah. This one is speaking for his wife. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Our men are treating us like slaves. Ah, someone need to stand up. Mr. Bernard, what is it? Who is after you? Please, this is my wife. Your wife, Fukamaka. Is she missing? You didn't see her. I've not set my eyes on her. What happened? Hey! Is everything all right? Oh, I'm not him. Talk to me now. There's no problem. In case if you see her, don't hesitate to let me know, please. Just tell me. Yeah. I will. Hi! Oh, Kamaka. Missing in this village. Hey! Why am I the man known over there? I'm looking for my wife. Did you see my wife? I don't understand. Your wife should be home. I've been looking for my wife. Since yesterday she left the house. She's not back yet. Why? We had slight issue yesterday and she left. Since then, Just she's not back. Um, um, please, in case you come across her, don't hesitate to call me, please. Sure. This is what fits men like you. You think it's every family you can try their daughter. Try your conjures and you will face the consequences. Nonsense. Hey, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? Over the I are we men are not slaves? So we men are not slaves. Great eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on like you so wrongly. 
Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Amen. Who's gonna stand for us? Amen. Are cheating? Anybody us? They don't even care. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Amen. Are treating us like slaves? Ah, someone need to stand up. Mr. Ben Daniel, sir, how are you? Father, I'm not fine. What happened? Father is my wife. Since yesterday we had a little misunderstanding and she left the house. See now, she hasn't returned and I've been looking for her all over the places. Your wife is self. Father, are you serious? So, where is she? She's self. She? Can we go and bring her? Please, just ask her to come back home now. I've been looking for her all over the place. Please, ask her to come back. I'm no longer angry with her. Let her just come back. Please, please, Father, please. Mr. Bernard. Father. I want us to talk. Uh, yes. Okay. Okay, sir. Can we talk here? Yeah? Uh, okay, go ahead, sir. Good. I have not come to apportion blame on you. But I am here to advise you to love your wife, respect your wife. She is your wife. She is a very good woman. Sir, I always cherish her and love her, sir. You, you have always cherished her then, but now you have changed. To the extent you are accusing me of having an affair with your wife. Father, that was, that was a joke. I was, jo I was only joking with her about that. You call that joke? To me, it's an expensive one. You don't joke with something like that. Nice. I also want to advise you, it is not good on the side of your wife and of the church. Please, try as much as you can to love that woman. Father, I, I give you my word right now. I will love her, I will cherish her, I will adore her. I will, Father, I will do anything. Just please, ask her to come back home, please. Let her just come back home. Your wife will come back home, but it will be in the evening. Uh, yes. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, Father. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. May God bless you. It's all right. Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. It's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh. Someone need to rise and fight over the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves over the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Good morning, Chief. Great eyes. Anita, good morning. How are you today? I'm fine, sir. Please, sit down. Sure. So why are you here? I... I came to inform you that... I am ready for the cleansing. Brilliant decision. <laughs> Very brilliant idea. I'm happy for you. You know, my kinsmen will be, will be very glad you took this decision. I'm going to inform them, and in seven days' time, you can go for the cleansing. Thank you, sir. Very good. <laughs> uh, I, I beg to take my leave now. So fast? Uh, you don't want to take anything like drink something? I have everything. No, sir. I'm okay. Thank you very much. It's okay. It's okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Uh, very brilliant decision you took. This is injustice. I in Nanamanaka how can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, 
this is injustice, yeah. hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh. Where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? Lord? I, I say, where are the truth sayers? Kedebendezi okunozi. I love a man Ah, uh, 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 my brother, pardon my manners. As I was about leaving the house this morning, I discovered that my wife has a lot of house chores to do, both the cooking and washing. I said, uh, let me just help her out with one, with at least the washing, as you can see. So I'm leaving everything for her. <laughs> You're not saying anything. You see, I was just imagining, like, like I didn't even know you are this romantic. Yeah. What you're doing is nice. It's a good one. Uh, at least I'm glad you know the importance of men helping their wives. Of course. <laughs> of course. It's a very good one. Yeah. Don't worry, you can go. You can go. I will join you at the side later. Ah. Okay. Uh, can I see you for a minute? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, let me see you quickly. William. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. What is going on? I thought you said this woman is supposed to go for cleansing for sleeping with the river. not understand so make me understand her people came here came to my house threatening fire and brimstone so i don't know what to do and you know the people of Uru Nebu, i don't have their strength at all i don't have i don't have strength for their problem their troubles but i i thought you said you are going to handle this thing privately i mean your own way that's it before you knew it she has already called her people all of them packed in my house. Wait. They paid you a surprise visit? My brother, you need to see this man. You need to see their faces. They are not friendly at all. They look so mean. They threaten that I should bring back their daughter before their next visit. You see, there's a problem. Man. You can make trouble with anybody in this village, but you see these room neighbor people. You can never know their next line of action. That is why I decided to be nice to her now. As I'm talking to you, that is what. In fact, look at me now. I'm now like a baby sitter and a nanny. I have no choice. So, how long do you intend to do this? As long as I can, just to take off their eyes from my body. Just take away their eyes off me. I don't, I don't care. Okay. I will see you. I will have to go to the site. That's no problem. I will see you later. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. It's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Over the new. Our women are not slaves. Hey, Andy, hmm? how far now? I do. Um. Andy, I need your help. As a matter of fact, you are the only person that can help me in this. Uh, and what could that be? My baby is very angry with me. Why is she angry with you? Um, I had issue with someone. She heard about it and got angry with me. So, how exactly do I come in? She's your friend. I want you to help me beg her on my behalf. Please. Is that all? 
that that's all. Don't worry, I will do it. Uh, I'll talk to her and I believe she will have a change of heart. Oh, thank you. I really, I really appreciate it. Anything for you. I'll do it. Right, thank you. All right. I, I will see you later. Sure, night. no problem. Right, take care. Take care. Yeah. All right. This calls for celebration. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> of course. Yeah. It's a win for us. Yes. Yeah. Therefore, we must celebrate it. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Can somebody tell me what we are celebrating? Oh, we are celebrating my victory over my wife. Finally, she has accepted to go for the cleansing. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait a minute. She was on the map. What's it? Don't tell me you rule the matter in favor of Eruka. What if he's glaring that he cheated on the wife? What's your problem? No, no, no. Does it mean you are parading yourself as a man of Obodenu and you don't know the rule? The rule is very simple. When a woman cheats on her husband, she's in trouble. And when the man cheats on the wife and the wife catches him, she is equal in trouble. That is the rule. Game over. Oh no, are you expecting me to have ruled otherwise? What's rubbish? Nonsense. No. This is injustice. Chief Sadimba, this is injustice and I can never be part of it. In fact, Anet is not going for any cleansing. I also know about the injustice of impregnating a young girl named Nkechi. What did you just say? You heard me right. And in case you have wrong with your ears, I will repeat myself. I said I also know about the injustice of impregnating a young girl named Nkechi. And who is Nkechi? Ask me again. You should be in the position to ask that question. See, Madoka, let me tell you something. Let me warn you. I've been keeping quiet because I want peace. But since it's obvious you want war, you don't want peace, what you shall get from now on my friend, shut up. Are you just saying no? What you for no? What you to do for yourself? When you are wrong, admit it. You're supposed to be pleading with your wife for forgiveness. And also, let me tell you, <laughs> if you think I will allow you, <laughs> do you want to blackmail me? Eh? Call it whatever you like. Do I look like I care? Get to call him pot black. And we say can you put one name? And we say can you put one name? I brought one day. Don't worry. Bring it on. Uh huh. Be my guest. Hey, 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 and I want to thank you for giving me that damning information. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> I'm a man. 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 I'm a Okay, get into the car. Let's go somewhere cool and talk. I'm not going anywhere with you. We're talking here. Meaning? I said I am not going anywhere with you. Okay, what do you want? When are you coming to see my people? See your people? For what? On what basis? On the basis of paying my bride price. Well done. Oh, <laughs> well done, well done, well done. Hey, Luca. Uh, it's your happy. Uh, yeah. Nick him. All right. Uh, well done. <laughs> yeah. Because you see, with this, your attitude, you're already spreading the news. Is that not what you want? This is what you want, so don't even blame me. Don't. Nkechi, you know I'm married, right? <sighs> Yeah, I know you're married. 
but there is no law restricting you from getting another and i wife. must tell you that i have no intention of taking a second wife therefore go get rid of this thing and get out of my way Maduka thinks I am joking. Because of this small love that we are playing, he's taking me for a fool. No problem. We shall see. You now stand a chance to get her. How do you mean? She's having a problem with that village rascal that has been distracting her. Okay. So? You can now moving this is the opportunity for you to get her where exactly will i see her her shop and you think she will not get angry with me for coming to her place of business there's nothing serious she does in that place that will make her get angry for you coming there to see her so just go there and do your thing <laughs> i am chooks mogolin sala mwaneri on Sunday, I will get whatever I want. Mwah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Anytime, any day, anything for you. You know. <laughs> I go pay. Okay, all right. Take care, okay? Bye. Man. Man, 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 man. I don't go to market tonight. Man, I don't got my hands. Hey, yeah. Give me block. Nah, yeah. Man, give it to Block now. Man, give it block. Hey, yeah. Good one. Yeah. Good one. What you know? What could it be? Choma has refused to talk to me, not pick my calls. Hmm. <laughs> Choma has refused to talk to me. Or pick your calls, I mean. Okay. <clears throat> Let me solve this trauma problem once and for all. Guy, find another woman. No. Look for another woman. I'm tired now. Today, trauma. Tomorrow, Choma. Next tomorrow, Choma. Find another girl. Why are you like this? No, tell me why are you like this? Why are you always negative when it comes to relationship between me and that girl? Eh? Why are you like this now? See, you don't make this game don't tire me, sir. This world don't tire me. Why are you not negative? Why? When they get, Choma don't already put herself in position of authority for your life. She don't put herself on edge where if she talks, HD may go left, you go left. Go right, you go right. Go up, you go up. Come down, you come down. Who be to myself? Who be to myself? Where be you? HD may my guy, based on who you be. Go they follow her up and down. They talk to her. Choma go they bomb levels. No go one answer you. Guy, ditch there for her no. And find another woman. Simple. Can you hear yourself? No, it's very obvious now. It's very obvious. The way you talk, eh? Have convinced me. Now I know why you cannot stick with one girl. You know, if you even hold one. Eh? Can you listen to yourself? See, I'm not blaming that girl. You understand? She's only trying to be a woman. So I don't blame her. If this is what you are, you are, you are talking. That's oh. why if I tell you, hold one girl, no, if you hold one. Oh. So now, Choma Mata don't make now. You don't they compare yourself with me. You don't they feel say you better pass me. I know better pass you before. I better pass you now. I be they need to tell you. HD man. I better pass you, Oga. You don't they feel say better pass because I of Choma. I better pass you. Truth is bitter. No, Allah. Since you feel say Choma are the only girl we did this our community where you feel follow. Eh? No, they complain for my ear. Your complaint don't fool my ear. I know why I hear again. I know they complain. I know they complain. I just say make I brief you as my guy within the song. That one I complain. I'm not complaining. You understand? Uh, no brief me about Choma. I know why I hear. Oh, bye, Awa. Uh, no, sorry, no verse. I don't brief you again. If I brief you again, cry. 
No, Allah. The only brief I want to hear from you now about your brother. How far? How far your brother? I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. I tell God, I beg you. I don't want to talk about that idiot. Let's forget about that money, Miss Road. As you say, you don't want to hear about your man. You understand? Just forget about that, that idiot. I don't want to talk about that. Don't be like that, now. Nah. Don't be like that. I just want to know how far the money we ain't supposed to give you. The Valery we ain't supposed to roja you now. How far? Oh. Uh, concerning that one, I go... I go go to the house this evening now. Uh. I go collect the money this evening. Uh, so what if you no go give me the money? Your wife go give me. Moreover, I know if we use that idiot to get hope. Now your wife be the main person who be say anytime when I reason her, she will respond. You understand? Forget about that idiot. I know they, I know use that one get hope. As I tell you, I go collect the money to the I go collect her. So no no go there. Oh Allah. Don't spoil. Oh See, Allah. We'll continue our game. I don't get interest for this game again. Because I don't win you. Okay, go give me this money. What you the talk? Okay, yeah. play, play game. Play game. What you the talk? <laughs> Make I tell you the truth as my guy will you be. Hmm? Now you, they cause this thing for yourself. Now you, they cause this problem. Now you, they gather this problem put for your head. I'm going to tell you the truth. How do you mean? How do I mean? Guy, for once in your life, ruffle your brother, ruffle that nigga. Now what do you owe? Oh? Enter in shop, collect goods, collect money. Mm. You get time. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Okudele, mm -mm. what is it now? See, see Okudele, I may be a rough guy that is living a rough life, you know, but they know. But I'm not a thief. I promo you he. They don't treat me like that now. I say to our zoom. Uh, I'm not a thief, for God. Even if I decide tomorrow to start stealing, should I start from my family? No, I go thief myself. Don't no, I talk like that now. Ryan. I know if you rob my brother, I know if you do that. You know they, you know they treat me like that. Even if I should start, if I decide tomorrow now, say I want to start stealing. No, chidi, no 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 but I don't know why you they protect who they use your emotions to jambul over. Now I don't still understand. Why you they protect that guy? Eh? Why you they protect who they use your to do to jambul over now? Oh, could they see? See, forget this way they talk. If you can't go to use me to do any jambul over, you know it. You never get anything for this life. Why well, ask if you can't go and do for me when you never do for me? Ah, uh -uh. now you talk like this. You know it. The only thing he has refused to do for me is to send me abroad. And I know the reason why he has refused. Because he knows very well that anything that makes me leave this town, eh, that is the end. And you and I know is the truth. That once I jump out for this town, if I leave this country, nothing in this life that will make me to come back. You understand? Mm. But even at that, I see no blame man. He didn't get the money. You know, get country where I won't go now, where if you can't go, no, if you sponsor me. You understand? What I need to do be saying to pressure him. Mm. With time, or guy, he go come along. So leave this one with the dog. Come on, anything thief now, nah, no one do him. I beg. No. I confirm, ma'am. Say if you can't go, get the money. He get a no be lie. But why did they use you play dumb? Why did they use your heart to jam all over? Did they play with your emotions anyhow? Now what do you not understand? Sigama, I tell you. Now I tell you truth. As my guy where you be, as my suicide where you be. You see this your dream of going to jam. Eh? He could die a natural death. Now me they tell you. you with the way where you did go. What you gonna bring that one now? No, now what you gonna bring that one? And I pray they pray for me. Let me pray out. No, they wish you bad luck now. It'll be bad luck, my No, now what you they do? Why you go say why you go say the dream could die? Eh? No, why you go why you go do like that now? Now guy, you they behave like wood and pour ice water. Oh god, oh god, see, I don't like him. Oh could you see, I don't like that. See, clean your mouth. Oh. You know they behave like HD. Oh god, go, go travel. For this village, you did this time. It go happen for your eye. No, you go there, you go see him. 
Yeah. If not pray, go, you, 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 you wish me say, I don't go travel, eh? Yeah. Back to sender. Yeah. Yes. I don't hear that. Back to sender. You go there, you go travel. No, they talk too much. I go tell what's in the action. Like you. Na actions. Village man. That's yeah. why if you say, I okay, go travel and you go happen for your eye. I want to see. You travel, see come now. on too. Ooh. Give my, give my money. Oh. I should not play, give my money. Which I don't want you now. This is injustice. I. In the Namana Camodio, how can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, this is injustice. Oh, hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? No. Obodaya Sakwano I I say we are the truth say I say no Kede Bendez Yoko Nozi I I know a man Look at you Look at you Why am I here? You know go I will never go for that cleansing I will never try it Eh? <laughs> And you see yourself. Now you begin to recognize that I am the man of the house. Hmm? Ineko. I want to go to that. See, next time you try this nonsense with me, something worse than going for cleansing will befall you. Nonsense. I don't want to I'm marrying with my own money. You come here to make all that for me. I tell you what to do. You're not quite well, so. Stupid, stupid woman. Yeah, one. Where are you? God, where are you? You are allowing this injustice. Why are you permitting this injustice? God, are you there? And you're watching this happen to me. There's something about we, the people of this town. We like it when people go straight to the point. So oblige yourself. The gain of this audience I've given to you. Go straight to the point. Chinks Mogolin Sala. Moaneri Kandio Bosi. You're just one of a kind. Look at the way you just presented it. So mature. Look, let me tell you something, Omwa. I like you. And I like you a lot. And if you permit, I am willing and ready to make you my wife. I am in a serious relationship. Oh, come on. You know that serious relationship is different from marriage. But serious relationship leads to marriage. I know. But you know I am more ready than the amateur of a guy. Says me. Say, I just want you to give me a chance. I promise you, you won't regret it. I am not interested. I was not actually expecting you to give me an answer right now. I just want to give you time to think about it. See, there's nothing to think about. I insist, dear. Ponder on all the things I have said. And you can give me an honest opinion. Can I go back to what I was doing before you came? Sure. See, so, I love you. I just want you to give me a chance and I will prove it.
have come here because um, I got information that your husband is not. So uh, uh, I felt that it's the best time to have this conversation with you quickly. Okay. I'm aware that the men of Ogodino have come together to decree that you will go for cleansing. And that you have also agreed to grant their wish. I have been pushed to the wall. And I do not have strength nor power to fight back. I'm at the brink of losing my home and I don't want that to happen. If it's going for the cleansing that that will restore peace to my home, then I'll do it. I'll do it to prove to them that I have never cheated on my husband, and I will never cheat on him. Slow down. You, of course, I know, and a lot of people know that you did not cheat on Eloka. You're one of the uh, good women, but then. A lot of young people look up to you for good character, so that's that, that's an aside, okay? Thank you. I'm going to be direct with you, Anieti. You are not going to go for that cleansing. Hmm? Like I said, I... I cannot fight them. I cannot fight the men in my husband's family. And if going for the cleansing will bring peace back into this home, then I will do it. It's nothing. I'll do it. I've agreed. I'll do it. I'm working on something. Please. I'm working on something. I just need you to just hang on a little. Just buy me some time. I think it's a little bit late. Why? I've already told them I'll go for the cleansing and they are preparing for it already. Oh, well, the same way you told them that you're ready for it, just tell them that um, right now you're not, um, you're not ready. That's it. You know? I, I don't think I can do it. You can do it, just do it. You can. What exactly are you working on? And how is it going to help stop men in my husband's family from asking women like me to go for cleansing? Uh, Anieti, uh, running out of time, I have to go now. But just do what I've told you. But I promise you, the next time we sit down, I'll tell you everything. Please, buy me some time. Okay? You can do it. Unannounced. This is my house, so I don't need to announce to anybody for coming to my house. Oh. Okay? My you brother always, has my house. You always have something to say. <laughs> come inside. No, I didn't come to sit. I didn't come to sit. I don't understand. So what, what are you here for? Since you already asked me. And he equally loaded, just like the one who will never bring out the money. I will tell you, I am here to 
collect money for my upkeep. Okay. Well, if that's the case, you have to come back later. It's in a better position to respond to that. Okay? Uh, okay, no problem. But then, um, since I already told you, maybe you find me something. Let me just used to hold my side first. Hmm. No matter how small, even if it's tricky. <laughs> okay. Let me get it. Alright. Now because of you, Mabase. Now because of you, if you can go for don't collect. But because he has a good woman like you, that is shielding him. That is why he never collects. What by your one? What do you mean by he for don't collect? What exactly is he collecting? No, you have nothing to worry about. Like I said, you have the one who have been protecting him. If not for you, if not for a good woman like you, Ma Basse, Ma Basse Machi, if you don't collect big time, but you are his savior. So, brother, go and get me the money. Can make it 5k if possible. You know, see the <laughs> You will never change. I'm coming. All right. Make it 5k. Yeah? And I'll go bring 3k. Go. Why did you call my wife and ask her to give me phone? Didn't you have my number? Well, that's my way of telling you that I'm not one of those girls who use I'm dumb. Nkechi. Nkechi here. Okay, Zeride. Ketalokwa. Nkechi, what do you think you're doing? Nothing. I didn't do anything. Moreover, I did not even tell your wife or anything. I just told her you're my business partner and she bought it. And um, I was also calling to check on you since you refused taking my calls. Okay. Uh, anyways, uh, how did you get my wife's number? I know that you've registered a new number and you're planning on dumping your old number because of me. Mr. Madoka, I equally know you've gotten a new number which is 091-60-71-61-85. Is that not your number? Kichiye, who are you working with? Nkechi? Nkechi, what do you think you're doing to me? I am only trying to tell you that Nketi Fekando here is not one of the girls who use them dumb. For goodness sake, I pleaded with you to use protection. I begged, I pleaded with you. But what did you say? You said no. That it means I don't trust you. You kept on doing stuff to me without protection. And was that the reason why you allowed yourself to get pregnant? Get pregnant for a married man? Nkechi, a married man with three, three children in the boarding school. Mr. Madoka, you talk too much. I will only tell you this once. Come and see the men of Ifeka and the family. Or are we forced to come and tell your wife the way you did stuff to me, without protection, without using a condom, a condom that I even bought myself. You refused. Why do you have to blackmail me? Why? Mr. Madoka, I never wanted any of this. I know that the women of Obodenu belong to the men of Obodenu. As a matter of truth, I was ready to allow you to come and join me until the man who will make me his permanently comes. But you force this pregnancy into existence and you must take responsibility for it. Or I will show you 
that I'm a woman of Obodeno who knows it all. Shut up! Did you hear it? Shut up! You talk! First of all, it was condom or no condom. Raw or no raw. Now, you want to tie me down to a break to... to, to. Nkechi, let me ask you. Didn't you enjoy it while it lasted? Were you not enjoying it skin to skin? Flesh to flesh? I was busy hammering you. It come, it boom, it come, it boom. And you were crying. Shouting, Daddy, Hada, 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 Hada. Baby, baby, you carry leg up, you carry head up, you turn up and down, you twist you. Now you want to blame me for what two of us enjoyed. Eh? You think you can blame me? Let me tell you, Kechi, I am a married man. And I have children. Therefore, I will not marry you. Get that into your skull. Mr. Maduka, you lie. Because you will. And it's a must. You lie. Hey, okay, baby. <laughs> baby, what? Why not wild dog, Mary? You, you, you're too sweet. Yeah? I must confess, you are the sweetest girl. I, 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 I will give you 100,000 Naira to terminate this pregnancy. And after abortion, another 100,000 Naira for your shopping. And when you're done with shopping, between now and month ending, <laughs> I'm quite in a degree. I am telling you, I'll provide all the necessary documents. I will take you to South Africa for vacation. I am telling you the truth. <laughs> If I am baby, eh? You're kidding me, right? Kid, you are a I mean it. I'm a man that walks my talk. Eh? And after that, eh? Be ready. Be ready to swim, tumble inside my money. Um, you just go and make a cigar fire now. And we will continue from where we stop. More can boom, can boom without condom. So you're not lying to me. But no pregnancy. Yes. <laughs> I have not to. I mean it. Okay, okay, okay. Give me the money. I'll go for the abortion before tomorrow ends. Okwago. From now to the end of business today, you will get the alert. I mean, hundred thousand naira will be singing in your account. Trust me. I'm be ready for more. <laughs> oh, you know me, you know me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, don't do it. Don't make me. Someone need to stand up. Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. How was business today? Well, uh, at least we're alive. So, so. The goods didn't come in today, but uh, what can we do? Why, baby? Uh, the truck driver called to say that the truck broke down and we are trying to fix it. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I hate to hear this. I hate it when trucks break down. It happens sometimes. Hope the goods are safe. Oh, well. <laughs> I hope so, too. What, what can you do? Uh. You just have to trust. So how was your day? Fine, thank you, baby. Um, your brother was here to see you. Did you didn't make him here today? Yes, baby. What was he want? He said he needed some money for upkeep, and I. Uh... And you did what? I gave that boy twenty thousand naira last week. What happened to it? No, what did he do with the money? Baby, can I explain? Explain what exactly? That it is irresponsible and stupid that you can't see it? 
Do you know that Echidime has rented out the portion of the family house that I gave to him? No, do you know? Oh, you didn't? Well, now you know. The money that boy gets from me aids his very stupid and wayward lifestyle. It has to stop. If Echidime does not stop, I'm going to stop giving him money. What is wrong with him? That, that man that thinks himself a boy has to grow up. He's a man. He has to... He has to be productive. He has to learn to be responsible. If for no one else, for himself. Do you understand? For himself. Maybe. I stop making that face. He, he comes in here when he knows I won't be home and makes a face for you and then you also make your face that way and then the both of you begin to look at each other's faces. I'm not going to be in the middle of this. That boy is irresponsible and he must be accountable for the kind of life he wants to live. Baby, please, can you stop saying all this? What am I saying? Allow me to explain. Okay. You're shouting already. I'm hungry. Well, food, what did you make? I made pounded yam and this is soup. You promised me I found more. What happened to them? <laughs> okay, I'll soon prepare that for you. It's a promise. You promised me I found it. <laughs> I'll do that for you, babe. <laughs> I'll prepare it. I promise. Oh, uh, please let me get something. Let me set it. I saw Ife Kego discussing with your wife in front of your house. Hmm. That fool entered my house. Yes, and you should be worried about that. Why should I be worried? As a matter of fact, I have achieved my aim of forcing Anita to go for the cleansing. Listen, <laughs> you can never be sure about that. Ife Kego is a terrible influence. Uh, yeah, listen. I still insist you find out why he came to your house in the first place. I tried my best to drop, you know, to, to find out, to hear even a little bit of what they were discussing. But I could not. Eh? Please, find out why, why he came to your house. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay, thanks for the information. I will find out when I get uh, home. Please. Meanwhile, what about the girl you said was coming to see you the other time? You know, we didn't discuss about it again. Uh <laughs> that girl, hey, that was she was she was she was extraordinary. Eh? Ha! Look, her soundtrack was so on point that hey, what? <laughs> even the she was on them man gave me a bottle of French wine to give to her after the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> hey. She was on them man. I didn't know he was listening to the. <laughs> uh. In that case, you will pass her to me. When you tell me, when you want me. Hey, hey, look, uh, manage that multitude, you know, you have them. You have a conglomerate of, uh, <laughs> of Fuku. <laughs> yeah? Let me manage my little circle. <laughs> I love that one. Yeah? How did you go with Madoka? You see, Madoka, he's the forgotten issue. I have him exactly the way I want. You see that information you gave me? Oh, you went a long way in helping me to cage him. Oh. Oh, yes. that is good. You know, I paid that girl to come up with the issue of pregnancy. It's your cool. And as I talk with you now, eh, Madoka has already promised that girl 100,000 naira eh? for the abortion. Eh, no? And then uh, 100,000 naira again after the abortion. And then he also promised to take her to South Africa for vacation. <laughs> Madoka. Madoka. You see, you, see, you, see, you see this man? This man is a very stingy, stupid man. See, if you ask a Madoka for money now, he will tell you he doesn't have money. Hey, half a one, I tell you, see, what's okay, Sessica? Aha, half a one, you're making it. I tell you, see, half a one, I say, now get jealous, Sessica. Get you going to Don't worry, but this time around, we'll deal with him. Uh, I don't uh, know how busy he is. Hey! Uh, now, my lady, John. So, you are the one who plotted that. It's my way. Do you know? Oh, my, it's your appetite. Do you know I thought the girl was pregnant through truth? No, I'm pregnant, 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 pregnant. Each appetite is always eh, ahead of time. <laughs> I will always get there, get what I want. Man, 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 Don't worry. Hey, danger. I told you, I'm general.
Come on, come on, stop now. Oh, come on, Choma, why are you behaving like this? See, I've been following you from, from, see, Choma. Just a word with you, that's all I want. Stop! I told you the other day that I am not interested. Can you be a gentleman and respect that? How can I be a gentleman when you are playing with my emotions? Eh? Look, all I ask is just for a feedback. I just gave you a chance for you to think about it. What feedback? Eh? I said I am not going to think about it. Choma, uh, I love you. This is the drama I will not take. This is the drama I will not take. Please, stand up. If you don't stand up, I'm going to leave. Okay, fine. Stand up. What are you doing with that amateur of a guy? That guy doesn't fit you. I'm sorry for shouting. See, I love you. Just stop. Let me be. Let me be. I swear I'm going to do anything you want. <gasps> I will do everything for you. I'll give you the whole world. I just, just give me a chance in your life. I'm not interested. I am not interested. Eh? Leave me. Leave me, I am not interested. Please, let me be. Actually, may you want money? Huh? What happened to the 20,000 Naira that I gave to you last week? Brother, you are acting as if you don't know that Naira has lost its purchasing power. You know if you buy anything with money again? Mm. I spent the money you gave me, so that is why I'm here for another one. Are you serious? You have spent the one I gave to you. So you come back for another one. I'm going to make it brief, slow and very clear so that you don't accuse me of not communicating. I do not have money to give to you. It's a lie. Brother, it's a lie. Brother, I know you have money. The last time me and my guy counted, we counted over 68 houses that you supply building materials alone in a building here. So how can you tell me you don't have money? Go inside and bring money from you. Uh -uh. Am I not your brother? Am I not entitled to eat your money? Huh. Such entitlement. You're entitled to eat my money, but you're not entitled to make your own money. You should be ashamed of yourself. Look at you. See the kind of friends that you make. I do fool. So what you and your idiotic friends do in the morning is wake up and begin to move around over the end, counting the number of houses I supply materials to. Huh? That's what you do. You can call it whatever you like. You can call it whatever you like. I did that for you to know that I know that you have money because I know you definitely tell me you don't have money. I'm here for my weekly allowance, so give it to me. Uh, okay. I don't have money for you. Get out. What? You want to put your hand in my pocket and take it? I have just told you I don't have money for you. Get out. But I give me that money. Get out of this place. This is my weekly allowance. You must give me the money. Let me just take it. Let me take it that somebody, somebody provoke you. But you give me that money. I will come back here at night. But you must give me that money. Ah, you must give me that money. Look at him. Eh? Pull it out. How can a young man like this refuse to be useful? Balo we gulu, a jolly man balo we gulu. You know I be an abe abam ogo, a jingu ogo. Am I worrying you? The question is, what did he come here to do? He came to see me. To see you in my own house. Wait, you also bring men into my house? Am I restricted from having visitors? I don't understand. No, no, no. Am I also restricted from having visitors, eh, Luca? What kind of a woman are you? What kind of a loose, loose, promiscuous woman are you? We are still discussing what you did. In fact, we're not even done talking about what you did. And you're already doing another one. Anyway. Thank God we're having this conversation because I want to tell you I will not be going for the cleansing. Ah, you must be joking. 
Hey. Uh, do I look like I'm joking? Of course. You are the most clearest description of a joker. The highest joker and biggest joker I've seen in my life. Because as I speak with you, the process of your cleansing is already ongoing. And there's nothing you or any of those your lousy, stupid boyfriends can do to stop it. Hey, look at you lie. Yeah. You lie. <laughs> so you know me. I'm a cop for alcohol. Okay. Uh, uh, hmm. Till then. We'll see. Oh, yeah, I tell you, boy, but wait, you're working out on me. You're working out on me. We are like evil. Why name that million and yet you are working out on your husband? Or some more about the evil. I am one who shall see, Mama Bassia. Don't worry. Ah, what kind of lousy, promiscuous woman can know? No, I can't. How did I end up like this? How did I end up like this? Why you wouldn't know? Eh? I'm very sure now that you're going to one of your boyfriend's house. Hi. How did I even end up? How did I even end up like this? No, 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 no. Leave me. Are you going to force me? No, I won't do a thing like then that. Then let me go. You're breaking my heart the more you're acting like this. Or am I asking for much? What is going on here? I say, what is going on here? Who is he? You're asking who I am. Don't worry, you know me. But that's not answer my question. I say, what is going on here? What are you doing here? Hey, hey, noise maker. Why you oh, I don't know you, but it's obvious you're nobody. You're nothing. As you can see, I'm in a serious meeting. So if you know what is good for you, just bam. I'm nobody. Me, I teach me nobody. Don't know what. What happened? What happened? Allow me to you. Why are you doing this? Why am I being what? watched? Why can't you for once behave like a civilized man? Oh, there is what? nobody more civilized than I have warned you. I have told you, Kiwali and Solomon, sir. What do this thing, Solomon, sir? Oh, yeah, you're the owner of Hey, look, are you sure Ife Kego is not having the best of your wife? Hmm? I mean, are you sure he is not sleeping with her? Ah, never. Never. My wife is the last person that will allow another man to see her nakedness. Not possible. I am very positive about this. Oh, okay. Why then is, is he defending her as if they are blood related? No, why will he speak to her to the extent that on the strength of what he told her, your wife has now decided that she's no longer going to continue with the same cleansing she agreed she would take part in before? Oh. And you're telling me that I'm not the normal. Uh, does it not boil down to what I said before? Huh? Why would a man visit a woman in her husband's house when he knows that the man is not around? I don't understand that. Yeah. Hey, give me the, yeah? <laughs> Open your eyes. Uh, I don't know, honestly. I can say, but no. I know my wife, Anita. I know her very well. She's the last person that will involve herself in this moment. I mean, she's too principal for that. You, you cannot be saying that, Eloka. No, no, does it mean you're not seeing all these things happening around you? You need to open your eyes. Open your eyes and see what is possibly happening right under your nose. It is possible that the person you are believing is moving towards this direction. It's actually going this way. You don't know. Well, anyways, I... I've heard what you said. I will, I will do just that. Good. Cool. And then, no, please, uh, we need to find a way to checkmate Ifeke Ego. Yes. But the way he's moving, hey, he might spoil things. Hey, you're not this careful. is injustice. Hey, it's just me that I'm going to do. Hey, it's just me that I'm going to do. Hey, it's just me that I'm going to do. Where are the truth say us now? Where are the upright men now? It's true. Monsign wouldn't be bad. That's a bit too soon. Uh, Monsign, it's, it's already up about the next month. Come on, please. Uh, for the sake of my business, I need to, you know, 
settle the books and and uh, anyway we'll talk about that later but what destination do you have in mind okay dubai yeah babe but then i need to get some my name is chooks mogolin sala an american biobosi i came here because of your useless brother okay um what is the problem did he steal your money no he stole little to steal my money he broke the windscreen of my car yesterday what hey what's wrong i i i, I hope hdm is okay Oh my I am talking about the waste screen of my car and you're asking if your brother is hot. Oh my God, what is wrong with this boy? Is he going, he, he, he doesn't want to put me in trouble. Hey! Uh, young man, um, please. Um, H.E.D.B. does not live here. He stays at the family house. Um, if you go there, you'll find him. Is that all you have to say? Look, I am surprised this is all you have to say to me. What were you expecting me to say to you? What I have just said to you is what you actually need to know, which is the fact that you have the wrong house address. He does not live here. Do you understand? He lives at the family house. I'm tired of people coming here to complain about it. Really, he's an adult. If he commits a crime, he's over 21, you get him arrested. He's not too young to go to jail. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Don't forget, my name is Chooks. Mwogolin Salah. An American Diobosi. Okay, I'll handle this my own way. Oh, come on, baby. This is not the right approach to this matter. And what would have been the right approach to this matter? That I leak his us. I need to understand. Let me talk to the guy. By all means, please. Uh huh. Let me check this um, site again and check these hotels in Dubai. Honestly, I can't believe he could do a thing like that to someone's car. At this point, do you still have any reason to continue with that relationship? Babe, babe, babe. That's not what we are talking about here. Look, I know you think that I hate your boyfriend. Far from it. I don't hate him. Look, that guy is so rude and uncivil. For you, Chooks is a nice person. Give him a chance. I will not. Why? How can I possibly go into a relationship with a guy I know nothing about? I don't even know his source of wealth. See, I might not be a rich girl, but I am not the one who goes after money. When you get close to him, you will know his source of money. <laughs> That's not a good advice to advise somebody. I'm not even listening to you. Let me ask you, what has this guy done to you that you detest him so much? There's done nothing to me. See, babe, I know my guy, no doubt. Has his own issue. But I love him. I love the way he is. I'm just saying it to you, you're my friend. So think about it. Think about it. So just a nice person though. Before it's too late. Just relax yourself. Okay. I'm so sorry about the way my husband spoke to you, okay? Please. Your husband thinks that I'm joking. I told him an American deal pussy. I will lock up that animal until my car is fixed. I will not release him. Okay. So, how much will it cost to fix your car? Do I look like a mechanic in your eyes? Let him take you to any mechanic workshop and they will tell him the price. Where is the car now? It's parked along the road towards the Genesis Street. Okay, so I'll send our mechanic to go check it out, if possibly fix it, okay? Please. Why are you getting yourself involved? I want to deal with that troublemaker myself. Whatever happens, it's going to affect the family one way or the other, and I don't want trouble. Please. Anita, we gathered from your husband that you have pulled out from the cleansing arrangement. Yes or no? May we know why? I have pondered over the whole thing. I am innocent. I did not go into any hotel room 
with any man. Since I married my husband, Eluka, I have never cheated on him. So I see no reason for me to be cleansed. Uh, Anete. <clears throat> you see, we sat down as a family and decided that you have to go for that cleansing. For the sake of her brother, your husband. Uchi, I'm sorry. But nothing will happen to your brother. Because I did not do anything wrong. If you do not go for that cleansing willingly, we will force you to do it. No woman can be forced into the sacred hut for cleansing. That, to the best of my knowledge, is the tradition of Obudinu Kingdom. Who have you been talking with? If I am married to a man of this kingdom, and I do not work hard to know the tradition of the man I am married to, then it could be argued that I am not committed to the marriage. But I am 100% committed to this marriage, so I know everything I need to know. You think I don't know you've been talking to Efeke Ego? And I'm very sure that he is the one that has been advising you not to go for this cleanse. Well, Efeke Ego is a respected man of this kingdom. So if a woman is talking to a respected man of this kingdom, I see nothing wrong with it. Ah, he will soon marry you. You, you, you know what? You may leave. Uh, Onu, you see, that son of a cow, Fake Ego, has been boosting her confidence. And uh, you can say that her uh, confidence is already overbloated. You know, based on what I am seeing, <laughs> she may no longer take part in that cleansing. Upe! She must do it. She must. Can you tell me how you are going to achieve that? Watch me do it. I've done the abortion. It was successful. Oh, thank you very much. So, how are you feeling now? I just feel dizzy. I feel tired. I think you should go home and uh, rest. Hmm? In the evening, you'll come out and then we'll discuss about our traveling. Okay, well, what about the 100k you promised to give me after the abortion? Oh, money is no problem. Hmm? I will transfer it to you. In fact, you will see the alert before you get home. Oh, that's why I love you. Thank you. I love you too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I have to go now. I have to go and rest. Oh, no, 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 no. I will drop you off, okay? Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Oh, but they knew. Aye. Aye. Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Hey, baby. Babe. So, baby, I just called the mechanic mm. to tell me the extent of the damage on the car mm. and also to cost it. And get back to me so we can fix it. Mm -hmm. What? No, so you can fix it, actually. I uh, mean, you and I. No, just you. I'm not contributing to it. Okay, I'll contribute seventy percent of the money. I just you, need. No, you, you what? You need what? Just thirty percent. It won't happen. Not for me. I'm not going to contribute even an expired Naira note. This is all on you. Because every time I try to clamp down on that young man, you hold me back. Huh? Echidime is your boyfriend now. You deal with it. You can handle it. By the way, why is it that the young man he, he offended has not picked him up yet? You should pick him up. That's the right thing to do. Pick him up. Put him in a dark cell for 10 to 12 days. When he's out, his brain will reset and go back to factory settings. But maybe 
Maybe then we'll begin to, to, to behave well. I don't know. But this, this is on you. Oh, please. Relax. I'm very relaxed. What are you talking about? I'm sitting at the class. Jeez. You people cannot kill me. Kill me now, you carry on with your lives. I don't understand it. I don't get it. That boy keep acting stupid and then you keep defending him. Why? No, why? See what you have to deal with now. Because trust me, I'm not going to be a part of this. Is the food is ready, let me know. I like to eat. We're just sipping on this to buy time. Thank you. I want to apologize on behalf of HEDMA for damaging your car. I know you're very angry right now and you have all the right to be angry. I am going to deal with that fool. Look at that jobless idiot. I am going to deal with him and after dealing with him, I will teach him how to stay away from trouble. There's no need for that. No, 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 no. Don't tell me that. I will make sure that I teach him a very big lesson. I need a favor from you. So what's that, baby? I'm not so baby. Okay. If you say so, so what do you want me to do for you? Okay. I want you to get a mechanic to check the extent of damage it caused to your car and I will fix it. What? So where would you get the money to do that? That shouldn't bother you. Get me the quotation. I will fix it. Is this girl for real? Damn! I've never seen a girl love a guy this way before. Why am I not the one? I want to thank you all for answering to this call. It means that we can actually work together and achieve something very good together. Um, the reason for this meeting um, is simple as much as it is complicated. So I just get straight to the point so that we can all begin to come up with different contributions and suggestions to help us move forward. Um, all of you seated here, in one way or the other, have been a victim of bad marriage. Yes. And that is why we're here. Um, your husbands have, at one time or the other, um, leveled false allegations against you for no reason whatsoever just to you know punish you um, um, it's a ploy you know um, that is devised by men who want to intimidate their women um, the truth is that the men of Obodeno feel that cheating is their birthright uh, they cheat on their wives Yet, they come up with some fictitious cultural and traditional um, contraptions just to gouge all of you and keep you subjugated. And that, I'm sorry, that has to stop. And that is why we are here today. Thank you very much. This is the kind of person we have always wanted. A voice that can speak for us. Thank you very much for this meeting. And we promise you that we are going to cooperate with you. Thank you. It's also important that you tell us the plans you have so that we know how to come in. Of course, I will, we will get to that. Um, of course, we'll all come up with plans together. Uh, this would be you know, a collective effort. But first and foremost, I just want to uh, make us realize how important this is. We're going to hit, but we're not going to miss. And in planning to hit and not miss, it starts with us understanding that this is really important, but most importantly, 
Someone need to stand up, someone need to rise, someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand, our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Hello, pretty. Hello. Did I just hear you say pretty? Yeah. Okay. With due respect, I'm a lady. A married lady for that matter. Mrs. Ife Keigo, so I'll appreciate if you address me such. Sorry, my bad, my bad. Mrs. Ife Keigo, sorry. Are you okay? Come on, it's just a handshake. I don't buy it. Come on. Okay. So, I... I don't know what you really want to say. So, you can go ahead, make it snappy before my husband or someone else who knows my husband sees us standing here or see you standing with me. You will not like what will happen, actually. Well, I am civil and I will continue to remain civil in this meeting. So there's no reason for your husband or anyone that knows your husband and knows you to feel bad about us. It's just a conversation, man. It's a chat enough. I'll take that English to be a genuine or polite mistake. Because I don't understand what you mean by us. There is nothing like us. What do you want? I mean... Who are you? Sorry, my bad, my bad. Um, where are my manners? Um, I'm Jude, but my friends and my associates call me JD. But you can call me anything you want. Jude, how may I help you? I don't know. Can we just, you know, take a ride in the car, go somewhere, or maybe go to the VIP bar at the end of the street. Now I just want us to chat in a controlled environment so that, you know, someone that knows you and your husband can see us. You feel know I me? Mean? How does that sound in your mouth? Does it not make you want to laugh? You're just meeting a lady for the first time. A lady who just confirmed to you that she is married. And you are asking her on a date. Is that not a psycho behavior? Who does that? Um, beautiful girl, I can be a lot of things, but trust me, psycho ain't one of them. I don't normally do this. And I just saw you and I just like you. I just want you to have a, you know, just a simple conversation. That's all. That's what I'm proposing, nothing more. What's psycho about that? Come on. Jude. Yep. I know. The man of Obodenu has made it a grave offense for one to involve police on civil matters. Let me make this clear. Don't try this again. Do not, because the next time you stop me and say this trash, you will be arrested by the police. And trust me, I mean every word that I speak. Don't do it again. Come on, girl. Come on, what? You working out? Not even your phone number? Oh, she feisty. Well, I can see why your husband loves you so much. You got class. She got class. Hey, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? Bobo Danu. I, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Our men are treating us like slaves. Oh, 
Someone need to stand up hey, yeah. Someone need to stand up Someone need to rise Someone need to speak up And add the women's mind That's getting out of hand Our women are no slaves what is going on? Someone need to rise and fight. Go for the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Go for the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying Cause they've been cheated on, accused so If this could be cheated, hmm? our men will stop the meetings, I'm telling you. Do you know how long I've looked forward for something like this? <sighs> Okamaka, indeed, there is light at the end of the tunnel. Yes, sir. This message today was the message of hope. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Because... Ever since I started going through this, my ordeal, I have just felt confident. My dear, you don't need to feel that way. Thank God for the brilliant idea you came up with. But I just pray other women does not sabotage this. Honestly, they will not. Each and every one of those women are going through something in their marriage. And looking at their faces today, I saw hopelessness. I saw women who are determined to do anything right to free themselves from marital bondage. And by the time Ifeke Ego was done with his speech, I saw hope, mm -hmm. I saw joy, I saw freedom spring forth from these women. Right. Because most of them came crying. By the end of the message, mm -hmm. they were all smiling. Ifeke Ego's message is a message of freedom, of hope. And every woman should embrace it. You're right. Because me, I am the number one person who embraced it. <laughs> yes. All I know is it is time for women of this town to be given a chance. Mm -hmm. So we have to rise. This is a brilliant idea. It is. It God is. bless that man. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. So baby, how did it go with the women? Very well. They embraced the idea, loved it. Wow. I'm glad they liked it. Mm -hmm. But the question now is, are they ready for the planned emancipation? 100%. You know, I, I saw people who have been oppressed for, for so long and just looking for freedom at all costs, you know? Baby, I am really bothered. Why? I just told you that these women are willing to, to work with me and, and work for themselves as well. I mean, uh, not only have they volunteered to work with me on this, but they also agreed to keep it a secret, you know, to be confidential about it. So, I think that we're on course. Hmm? <sighs> Babe. Yes. These people are very mean, and they may decide to hurt you. You're up against men who derive pleasure in cheating on their women. And they can do anything to anyone who tries to open the eyes of this woman. Please. Yeah, but I have told you countless times that no one can do anything to me. Stop bothering yourself. Okay? Okay. So... Guess what? What? Look at me well. And guess. Are you pregnant? No way. How what? did you know, babe? You asked me to guess. Yes. <laughs> what? I am pregnant. <laughs> come. Come here. Come here. <laughs> What the hell? 
Thank mm -hmm. you, baby. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to be a father. Oh, yes. <laughs> this is beautiful. Thank you. Where have you been? I mean, where are you coming from? Hey, look, why are you suddenly interested in where I'm coming from? Because I'm your husband. Well, you don't care. I'm your husband. Ah. And I demand to know where my wife is coming from. I see. Well, if you must know, I've been around. What kind of nonsense answer is that? Being around is not an answer to my question. Hey, look, at this. I did not come here to be questioned by you. I came to pick up some of my things. Let me just pick it up and go, huh? Really? Yes. Come back here! Not until you answer my question. I don't understand why the sudden came. Like why you want to know where I'm coming from and where I've been. You are the one who threw me out of your house. You left me outside this door nights. I slept here for days, took my bath outside, knocked on this door every night for you to open the door for me, and you did not. All of a sudden, you are questioning me. So why are you questioning me? What do you want to know? Hey, stop speaking English. See, if you are planning to run away from the cleansing, you are a liar. Yes, because the arrangements for the cleansing is concluded and is happening this weekend. Oh, really? Oh, yes. Well, I remember telling you I am not interested, and that still stands. I will not go for that cleansing. Anita, mm -hmm. why are you playing with fire? <laughs> hey, look, you got it wrong. Rather, you are the one who is playing with fire, and it will consume us both if you're not careful. No, it will consume you. No, it will consume us, hey, look, Because if you want me to be cleansed, fine, no problem. You lead the way. They have to cleanse you first before anybody will cleanse me. Hmm? Mm -hmm. You heard me. Do you know what just spoke now? Abomination! That's what just came out of your mouth. Mm, yummy. And I want to make sure you are punished for that. I see. Are you done? Who is beating this drum for this one in Bamili? We shall find out. And um, make sure you tell your kinsmen that if they want their wives to go for cleansing, they should lead the way. They should be cleansed first before their wives. Tell them. Hmm? Who is feeding this woman with this information? They call the one in Bamilia when we're out. Sudden, his numbers are all switched off. <laughs> Let it not be that Madoka has blocked me. Else, Madoka will not like the madness I will display in his house in front of his wife. Uh -uh. Did I force Madoka to promise me hundred thousand? What's this now? Which, what, what is this now? Why is this man doing this now? Hey, Madoka will not like me. He will not like me. Okay, let me try it one more time again. Hey, it is still not going. Madoka, Madoka, you are playing with fire. You cannot play with Inketi Fekandu and go scot free like this.
Oh, good day, good woman. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, so straight to the point, I called you to explain directly to you because if I fail to do so, you might feel I'm playing games with you and I don't like playing games with people. Such thoughts never crossed my mind. Well, um, the mechanic I called for the quotation of this car actually got a Panobita involved. But the Panobita said he's waiting for a feedback from Newi. So long and short of the story is that nothing tangible has been done. Okay, don't worry yourself. They're already fixing the car, so it's going to get ready tomorrow or next. <laughs> oh, really? Then that means we should refund you then. Oh, don't bother. I don't understand, Chutes. We said we were going to fix the car. So if you did it with your money, we have to refund your expenditure. I want us to become friends. I want us to know ourselves better. That's all I want for now. <laughs> I'm married, Chooks. Come on, don't worry. We can still be friends. If you're not going to take the refund of what you spent on your car, that means we've come to an end of this meeting. And please, you men of Obodenu should keep me out of your illicit move. I don't want to be involved. Have a nice day. Is it not clear now? No, the plans of Ifek Ego, is it not clear now to everybody? Are we not all seeing it? No, we will not allow that plan to stand. That decision must not stand. Because if it does, all of us will be put to shame. Uh, uh, look, we don't need to bother ourselves with this. Eh? I have plans on ground to deal with that man. Ifek Ego, I have plans. In fact, I'm already dealing with him. Whatever he planned with those women will... Collapse like a pack of cards. See, she happened, I need to understand what you are planning. You need to expect that action. Listen to me. If we fail to checkmate that young man, like you said, I am afraid that he will he is going to succeed with all of this. It will not get to that. You are delaying. It has already gotten to that. See, I told you people, let us match this young man strength to strength. Allow me to attack him physically. You refused. Hey, Loka, there is no way we are going to allow you to reduce this into physical combat. Oh. No, we cannot. See, let me tell you, sometimes you do the other way around. You match atrocity with atrocity and things begin to work. Diplomacy. Diplomacy is the key. We have to apply diplomacy in this and I'm telling you we are going to succeed. Just calm down, exactly. calm down. Exactly, that's what I'm working on. Uh, you need to be more urgent. Be more urgent. Pour more fuel into the fire. That's it. I am on this. Yeah? I assure you, look, by the time I'm through with this, oh yeah. Give me a word now. I'm not going to things are getting bad. Things are spoiling. Things are spoiling. You keep telling us, let us wait. Let us wait. Diplomat. Things are getting real bad. Put it down. Watch. I'll see the results. Keep it up. I'm working on it. Uh, we are working on it. Yeah. So, I have decided to call this meeting to hear from us on what Ifekego suggested to us because i am one person who has suffered a lot in my marriage and i think it's the right time to put an end to a sorrowful marriage same with me i am ready to go to any length to make sure that those evil men they are off our neck do you know that at some points i started considering suicide hmm. thank god you didn't commit suicide hmm. I am glad that all of us have seen the ugly side of marriage. And this is a time we plan on how to set ourselves free. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes. Eh? So at this point, I think we all have made up our minds. And I like the determination in our hearts. Let's keep it up. What about the members that are not here? I will communicate with them. 
So I decided to call both of you because you are closer to me. Thank you very much for coming. I appreciate it. See how long he has kept us here. Hey, okay. Sitting down here waiting for him. Waiting for him. Yeah? And I go. I see I have um, August visitors. If I can go. We are not interested in your pleasantries. So please keep them to yourself. We are here to deliver a message to you. That's why we come. And that message is this. Whatever it is you think you are planning with those women, it's not going to work. Therefore, it is better you put a stop to it now that you still have the chance. That is why we're here. I cannot make sense of anything you said. Huh? Okay, fine. I will break it down for you. What we are telling you is to stop giving those women fake hope. Because whatever you are discussing with them is as good as dead. Okay, I see. My plans with the women of Bobodin are as good as dead. Yeah. And you two run to my house. Scared and worried. Can you not see that your actions have betrayed you? The plans are dead and you're here. Both of you really should be ashamed of yourselves. You want to keep our women in bondage perpetually so that men like you can continue to be promiscuous and then no one questions you. I have an advice for both of you. Do not unleash onto other people's daughters what you do not want unleashed on your daughters. If you can go, hmm? I mean, that's if I called you. In a vagina, man, man. In a. We are going to forget that you are a man of our town. We will deal with you decisively if you fail to put the stop to this nonsense right now. That is the message. Fear is all I see. Men like you want to keep our women subjugated and come up with a lot of traditional and cultural jargons just to keep them in bondage. Your time is up. I've decided to put an end to it. I've started to put men like you in check. It will not happen again. It ends now. In that case, something bigger than you can imagine will happen to you. And it's imminent. Mark my words. Oh, well, before it happens, uh, both of you would have to go for cleansing. Yes. It's actually the both of you that need it. Get out of my house. Out. Listen. Get out. You walk me out of your house? Do you know, I thought I don't want to go. I told you. And walk me out of your house. Watch alone. Ha! I don't want to come here. I know you can like this. Dala. Stop. Stop. What is it now? What? Hmm? I am gay. I don't even know why you're doing this here. I mean, why? This is my house, so what's the problem? Would you live here with your wife? Yes. So why are we doing this here? Because I have the right to do whatever I want to do in my house. This is my house, so feel free, okay? In fact, you've proven to me that you're different. I mean, this town hall is 
different. <laughs> this is not Blala Blue, you know. <laughs> so I will go make some food for us, eh? and then we'll go for the second round. It will make sense. What do you think? Ah, I know you like it. Hello, Hello. Yes. What is this? What are you doing here? You're asking me what I'm doing here. I mean, why are you biting into my house? What's your problem? Hello, Ka. So now you bring women to your matrimony. Oh, she's even she's even going inside my house. You bring women to your matrimonial home. Yes. Because your wife, Anietie, traveled to Eke to go and see her people. So you now bring women. Hi, hello, Ka. I am glad you know that this is my house. And I'm doing what I like to do in my own house. So why don't you get out, go to your own house, and do what you want to do there? Mua, get out. Yes. Mua, get out. Makaneche, hello, auto. Hello, ka. It is not fair. Well, it's obvious. Hey, look, you are wicked. Well, it's obvious you have nothing meaningful to say. You are wicked. Oh, yes. You are that, you're this jobless. You right? are very... Men of no, you, you know. are jobless. I'm jobless. In a, in a, in a, going to people's house to poke your nose in things that do not concern you. Are you that jobless? Why do men like you take pride in, in cheating on your wives? Why? How is your business? Why? It's your business. Hey, well, it's my business now because I have seen you. Uh -huh. Oh, let it be on record that I have seen you. Which, hey, which guy monkey record? Who cares about your record? Oh, Keep yourself, uh, uh, oh, 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 you have nothing meaningful to it's say. It's alright, no problem. Uh, go, go, go. One day you are going to care. Let yeah. me be on record yeah. that yeah. I have seen you. So, I'm talking that you're still going inside to go and meet her. It's alright, no problem. No problem. We'll see. See, Choma. If you continue being angry with me, it won't help me in any way. I'm not enjoying this visit. Since you've decided to continue doing the things that I hate, I would not advise you again. Hmm? That means you never loved me. Eh, hey, now. You never loved me. You're not making a mistake. Yet you still want me to continue making that mistake. You cannot succeed in weakening me with emotional blackmail. This friendship is no longer working for me. I just want you to give me a break. No. No, don't say that. Mm -mm. Don't say that. Yes, there is nothing like giving you a break. Okay? You're not going anywhere. We stuck here together. We're in this together. Okay? You're not going anywhere. Wait. Don't tell me it's because of that guy, you. Yes. Don't tell me it's because of that guy. Because if it's because of him that you are acting this way, I will kill him. Mm. Because of you, I will commit murder. We are not going anywhere. I don't understand. You hurt me so much and you don't know about it? See, if I hurt you, I've apologized. I'm sorry. But my decision still stands. We're in this together. No leave, no transfer. You're not going anywhere. Okay? You have accepted to be my girlfriend. I won't leave all these things for another person to come and be enjoying. It's not possible. <laughs> so please, learn how to get used to things with me. Okay? Please. Anyway, give me water, let me drink. Give me water now. What was the meaning of that nonsense you did earlier? Do you know how much I paid that babe to bring her home? You should be ashamed of yourself. Hear what you're saying. You should be ashamed of yourself. Are you not ashamed? Hey, Luca, are you not ashamed? Are you talking to me? I'm talking to you. And when you're talking in my house, you bring your voice down. I built this house when I had any money. Uh -huh. You put it in one block. Walk him. You're the one who needs to go for cleansing. For you not only stink, Evil, perverted, and wicked. Fake ego. You fake ego. Oh, good. See. You are beginning to bite more than you can chew. And I assure you, it's going to break your jaws. I have very strong jaws that can break all kinds of bones. So do not worry about my jaw. I was born ready. You fake ego. Ha! Do not say we did not want you. Do not say you were not warned. No, no, no. 
You know, you men go about town cheating on your wives and you do not want your wives to cheat on you. I think that your wives should cheat on you so that we can balance out the equation. How do you reason? How? Now I'm beginning to understand you're not mentally stable. Who married who? Do women marry the men or the other way around? See, if you can go, let me warn you. Stop smuggling those rubbish, those nonsense into those women's brain. Uh, hey, look, I know you, you know your problem. You have an ancient mind. And you think this is 1929. You, you are entitled. It's wrong. Women are human beings just like you. They have feelings just like you. So you cannot cheat on them and expect them not to cheat on you. And when you have your suspicions, it's a problem. No, come Why on. Him, Jacob, where no? Uh, why him, Jacob, no? Uh, and you forget that you're answerable to her as well. Come. If you can go. Oh, then, uh, okay. <laughs> I understand you now go from house to house. To poke your nose into things, matters, affairs of other men. Things that do not concern you in any way. I, I do go from house to house, actually, to without promiscuous men like you. But your house, I'll never bother. Your wife already has you in her cooking pot. Listen to me and listen real good. If it's about our women getting the desired freedom from your draconian setup, trust me, I'm never, not in this lifetime, going to back down. Then you're going to burn. <laughs> you are going to burn. I want to man to Anro. A woody see a woman. Why? Okay, man. Why? Okay, man. Abozing Kitalisian Sina, a celebrity. This is injustice. I am a man, a camodio. How can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, this is injustice. A judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the treats? Hey, where are the upright men? Hello, beautiful soul. You even look more beautiful now than the last time I saw you. What's up? You again. Do you live here or have a shop around here? Oh, no, 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 not at all. You know, I remember your threat the last time. I just want you to know that I mean no harm. And if I gave you the impression that I meant any harm to you, forgive me. I don't mean any harm, baby. I don't know what you're planning. And I don't know who told you I was coming to the plaza today. But I must warn you, and I want you to take this very seriously. Stay the hell away from me. Oh, see, I get the sense that we are quarreling. Of course we are quarreling. If you don't know. Awesome. Yes. What is the cause of the quarrel? Did I miss something? What's that your name again? Jude. Oh, Jude. Jude or JD, whatever your name. Oh yeah, JD, you remember? Yeah, of course I do remember. I don't have time for all of this excesses. I warn you again. Stay away from me. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait. No, no. So let me just tell you the truth. I'm just going to go for broke with 10 days. From the first time I set my eyes on you, I don't know, I just, I just fell in love. Even the moment I left you the other time, you were the only thing that comes to my mind, even up till now. I can't explain it. And I remember telling you the last time you tried saying this trash to me that I am married. And how do you know my name? Oh, come on, I do my homework. I also remember telling you that being married doesn't stop us from anything. Yes, all you just have to do is say yes to me and let me do my magic. You're saying all of this because cheating is very normalized in the, in the life of the men of Ubudeni. But I must tell you that I, Nyoma, Mrs. Ifekego, is not wired like that. I would never cheat on my husband. I, I know your husband. Your husband is a very busy man. I, I, I know his schedule. He doesn't have time for you. He doesn't deserve you. 
You know, the man that will wake up every morning and serve you breakfast and stay beside you. Trust me, if you say yes to me, I will be giving you unhindered orgasms, baby. I see you're very jobless. I'll advise you get a life. You're sick in the head. Very, very sick in the head. Hey. Oh, oh. Oh. What am I gonna do again, baby? Well, this game is hard to get. What else am I going to do now? What kind of a man been if this? Have I ever have said every possible thing that a man can say to who a woman? Why is baby by baby? I beg. Hey! 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 Oh, what do you say? Uh, Madoka, so this is where you are? This is why you've not been taking my calls, Madoka. Get you here. Please. Please. We can go out there and discuss. We are not going any outside to have this discussion. We are discussing it here. Hello. Who are you and why are you creating a scene here? Are you alright? Let me tell you, if you know what is good for you, just mind your business. Sit this your big ass here and don't talk to me. You must be very stupid. You must be very stupid to tell me to shut up and sit down. Are you okay? Are you mad? You are the one who is mad for interfering in what does not concern you. You are the one who is mad here. I don't think you know who you are talking to. Who are you if not a man snatcher? What? You are yeah. a man snatcher. You just called me, Ugone, a yes, man snatcher. Yes. Me? Yes. Me? What are you doing? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Why are you people fighting? Stop it. 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 Stop Well, good afternoon. What are you doing here? I've decided to join you in your business. Say that again. You heard me right. So when are we getting started? <laughs> ah! Hey, Chidima. You're not joking, are you? I'm serious. Yes. <laughs> This has got to be the best decision you have made all your life, I tell you. And I hope that you take it seriously. Eh? So when are we getting started? Listen, let me tell you. If you keep your head down and learn the trade, it won't take as long as you think. Honestly, in less than what, 18 months? I'll settle you, you know. I'll put a big shop for you, stock it up, and then you, you can be on your own and uh, have a good life. Life is not that hard, Ichidimi. Stop being strong headed. You have a very beautiful destiny, if only you can just apply yourself. Anyway, today is not a day for lectures, but congratulations. Thank you for your promises. Bro, brother, you have not told me when I'm starting. It's fine. Um, come by my office later this afternoon. So work out a schedule that fits you. Huh? Oh, how are you? I'm okay. I thought you've gone back to Enugu. Uh, not yet. I made up my mind until the first phase of my building is completed before I return to Enugu. Uh, you asked to see me. Oh, yeah. Um, it's about your friend. I don't know. She's giving me tough time. I know it was going to be like this. Don't worry. Just keep pressurizing. I'll be compelling her. 
she was to come. You see, that's one thing I like about you. You, you, you have this ginger spirit. You keep giving me hope. Yes. So you, you think so? Very sure. Sure. Yeah, very, very sure. Okay, no problem. You see, well, send your details to my phone, and I'll credit you. <laughs> Thank you. I trust you. I know you can. Do. See, I am Chooks Mogolin Sala. Chooks, Chooks. Anna Mary can do your bossy. Abu Modogu Amol on Sunday. I trust Credit. I will. Thank you. Hey, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? Obo Denu. Hey, hey. Are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? What are you doing here? Where is my wife? What kind of question is that? Are you kidding me? Do I look like the keeper of your wife? You think I'm joking? No, you think I'm here for jokes, right? Now let me tell you. If I wait for my wife till tomorrow and I don't see her, you will know my true color. Let me not say till tomorrow. Ah, okay, so that's, that's so bad. Uh, um, a gentleman. Brother? Open the gate for me. What is he saying? Ignore that tout. Open the gate. From all indication, the chapter of HDMI has been closed in your life. So it is time to open another one. Babe, if you're talking about me moving on with another man, I will not. Are you going to remain like this for the rest of your life? No. And then it's time to move on. Look, Chooks loves you. And he's not coming to you for a relationship. He's coming to marry you. See, babe. This Chooks market you're trying to sell, it will not sell here. Mm -hmm. I guess you hate that the guy so much. Far from that. Why will I hate him? Then give him a try. No! I am not interested. I enjoy your truths now. Choma! Huh? Why, why are you so uptight? Hey, hey. Give this guy a try and see what he can. I don't understand you. Leave me alone. This guy will change his job. This job. I'm very okay with this. I will not give you water. If you ask me for anything, I need you water. I will not give you. Let you. smile on your face. Yeah. <laughs> what happened? It shows good news. Well, something good happened today, surprisingly, I tell you. Talk to me, baby. Your man, H.E. Demon, showed up here and told me that he's now ready to join you in business. It's a lie. I'm telling you the truth. I was just about getting to the... I saw him standing I'm like, why are you here? You know, in our usual fashion, I thought we are going to have a face-off. He told me, no, I'm not here with trouble. I have made up my mind to come join you in business. I'm like, say that one more time. He repeated it. I'm okay. Sounds like you're serious now. Oh my goodness. You know, you have just made yourself the best decision ever. You know, so I told him to come by the warehouse later and uh, get acquainted with the staff. And surprisingly, he came around. I'm telling you, I introduced him to the manager, sales staff, everybody. He just clicked with them one time. Wow. <laughs> now, this is the surprising part. The big part is that he made a huge sale today. Yes, some guy showed up, um, wanted 32 pieces of aluminum doors. I don't know how he did it. He convinced this guy to buy 32 pieces of wooden doors and pay cash. 
babe. I'm, I am as shocked as you are. That means he has some marketing experience. Would I put it that way? I, I think he's got the, you know, the strict thing. There was a way he was talking to this guy. You know, you know the language. You know how they talk in the streets. I don't know. Well, he's sort of connected to the guy and was able to convince the guy, whatever. But we got the money, you know. Oh, but if he's serious, um, I think he has a bright future in business. He can just keep his head down. Oh, babe. <laughs> I'm so happy. Like, seriously, all I want for him is to be straight-headed and I think that will work for him. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> I'm so happy, babe. I know you're happy. <laughs> yes, yes. You don't start. <laughs> but that's the truth, that Your boyfriend finally has a job. Baby. Your man. Baby. He your guy. <laughs> Stop it. He finally has a job. Eh? Mrs. H.E.D. <laughs> I have heard a lot about you. And I thank the gods for the blessings they have given to the kingdom through the works of your hands. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I must say that it's an honor to have a man of your caliber in my home. Give you your very tight schedule as a chief priest of the day, to have you here is an honor. Honestly, it is not an honor, it is your right. I gathered you visited my place yesterday, but I was not around to see you. It is only right that I come to know why you visited me. I am Ubebe Naja, the chief priest. <laughs> Uh, as Alice in truth, there's a lot of people who say different. <laughs> okay, but I'm already here. So, why did you visit? Um, it's Alice. I came to you with a case of injustice meted out against the women of the day. I had wanted to involve the police, but then I remembered that, um, there's a law that says that uh, issues concerning officers, the people of the Bodhi must first be treated amongst us before taking to the police. But what exactly is the problem? Um, I am going to tell you, but first I would like to know if the gods of Obodenu have decreed that our men can maltreat their wives okay. without consequences, if that's part of our tradition. Well, I, I would like to get a detailed story so I can be guided by the girls in my orphans. Yes, Alusi, you are aware that most of the men we have in Ubedeno are, are philanderers, very promiscuous men who cannot even go a day without cheating on their wives. But it is natural that uh, one KJZ in Uno has the right of having concubines. It is their right, and um, uh, no one can take them by the way. No one. I, mean, I agree with you, man. but is there a law that says that uh, these men who cheat after cheating would not have their women come and pay? for their sins, you know, uh, and take the fall for them, you know, <laughs> because I don't understand why, why they do that and still ask their wives to go for cleansing. It is not part of our tradition. In as much as it is in their nature to um, cheat, they, they, they should do that and do not subjecting women to slave or making a woman stay good. That shouldn't be called. That should be stopped. Exactly, that's my point. If a man is so classless to cheat on his wife, now let him cheat, but let him be the one, you know, to pay for his sins. You know, and not try to drag the wife into it. It is only men of weak spirit that are always interested in intimidating women. 
um, making a woman escape from it and all that, which, uh, which, which is, uh, tradition is against it completely. Our tradition is against it. I'm happy. I'm happy as I said that, you know, we're, we're, we're thinking along the same lines. Because, because as it stands, you know, these men go out to cheat on their wives. And then try to get the women to come go for cleansing. I don't get it. So what I'm suggesting is men who go ahead to cheat on their wives and then want their wives to go for cleansing so that they can technically get them into taking an oath. How about them, you know, leading by example as the head of the house? So they should go there, take the oath first. You know? But you are just right. That is the way it is. If a man feels his wife cheats, uh, he should have the courage to approach the sacred stone and take an oath. Mm -hmm. Swear that he is very sure of what he is saying. Exactly. If a man fails to do that, which means he is not sure of himself. And should let the woman be, he should leave the woman alone. Exactly, it's Alice. You have all these elders who know nothing about our tradition. You know, prancing around and, you know, uh, making life difficult for this woman and hiding behind tradition to commit atrocities. It's, uh, I, I'm happy you're saying this, is Alison. And I am going to get them to come and listen to you and hear you say this directly. I'm going to tell them that you have demanded to see them. Oh, yes. So many of them are not be able to come to me. But never mind, I know how to handle it when the time comes. It is fine, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. There is nothing you will ever tell me that will make me listen to you. You are a wicked man. I regret everything we ever did together. Ugo. Ugo ne. Why are you talking to me like this? Is it because of the useless stories she have told you? That, 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 that make you call me names? Oh no, you know she's a liar. She is not a liar. You had something doing with her. Uh, yes, I had something doing with her. But we've ended it just like people end things. I, I don't just know why she don't want to leave me alone. For the first time in my life, I saw myself fighting with a woman over a man. A married man for that matter. Well, I came out here to see you and to tell you that it is over between us. Don't you ever come here again. Excuse oh, me. Oh, no, 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 Ugo. Uh, Ugo, baby. Can't you understand? I love you now. I don't love her again. Hey, you're my sweetheart. You're the woman after my heart now. Huh? Please, listen, I, I have made reservations somewhere. Please, let's go there. Eh, under controlled atmosphere. We, we, we can jolly and, 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 and settle this. I have like... nothing to settle with a married man. Go back to your wife and don't you ever come here again. Don't you ever block me again. Nonsense. Oh, hey! Kidding no din so good here. Huh? This this sweet babe. I will go by now. I can't leave you after just one outing. You know you know how to do this thing. Huh? You you know how to do it. You go, I beg, I beg. You you, you will never escape. Never. <laughs> I have not started dealing with you. I have not started. Ugamba. 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 are you now a spirit? Why are you stalking me? <laughs> Leave me alone now. Leave me. Leave me alone. I will keep stalking you until you fulfill all those promises you made to me. You see all those promises? All of them. You will fulfill them. One after the other. Today. Here and now. Else. You will not be able to recover from what I will do to you. Eh? Eh? Where are you going? I'm still talking. You want to walk out on me? Nkechi. On I go. What is wrong with you, Fekego? I mean, what is wrong with you, Fekego? What is wrong with you, Fekego? I mean, what is he planning to achieve? Now he wants to pitch us against the priest? He has already done that. That is what he has done. You are seeing it. 
I am going to teach that young man the lesson of his life. By the time I'm done with him, he will be regretting why he started what he is doing. My question is, how do you intend to do this since he has gone to the chief priest? Listen, you see, every single man has his price tag. The man can be bragging because you have not decoded the price tag. You see the chief priest? I will invite him over. And something is going to happen. This case is going to turn against that fool. Good. Good. Turning the table against him is the only way to end his rascality. Exactly what I'm going to do. Yes. By the time I am done with Ife Kego, he will be regretting why he decided to stand on our ways. Oh, no, I cannot wait. I mean, my happiest day will be the day I will see this young man on his knees, begging us, begging, probably crying. <laughs> eh? Please. Whichever way or measure you want to approach this, get me involved. If it has to do with money, let me know. Tell me my own contribution. I can even double it. It is going to happen. Very soon, exactly what is going to happen. And when it finally happens, we are going to invite him over. Make him to nail down. Hi. And then we will give him condition. You, come. you are very positive about this. Oh, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> this is injustice, oh, eh, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? Oh, where have you got the Naja? You know, you are that one man of this kingdom who has continued to attract respect from all. You are that one friend of mine who I hold in high esteem. You are that one man who has continued to speak for the gods of this land. And I, I feel so delighted that you honored my invitation. Thank you for coming, sir. Can I tell you the truth, Mr. Uh, go ahead, Mr. Alison. I'm listening. Uh, please, can we sit down? Men who walk on the path of injustice and wickedness cannot be friends to the priest. I, I, I don't. I wouldn't know why you would say that. <laughs> this is still me. I, I, I am still the same man, uh, the same one that you hold as your friend. I have not changed. You can ask people. I am still the same person. Uh, why will you say this? Under your watch, as they will know, the Prime Minister of this great kingdom lose men for body and kingdom, succeeded in bringing untold punishment upon the great women of this kingdom. That is why I'm here. I have come to see you. Because I want that style stopped. Are you, are you sure you are not mistaking me for someone else? Uh, this, you just said that I'm the know who of Obodenu, and that is correct. I am still the know who of Obodenu, that upright man who has not done anything wrong. Uh, why are you sounding this way? Uh, Women of Obodenu. And women married into Obodino are not slaves. Sure, I agree. They have their rights as human beings. And no one can take such rights away from them. If any man feels that he wants his wife to approach the sacred room for cleansing, such a man will first and foremost approach the sacred room for an oath taken. Such a man will take an oath that he is very sure that his wife has defied herself. We don't live on assumption. No man should live on assumption and thereby caging his wife. Uh, well, as I say, I actually packaged something for you. <laughs> 
And uh, if you permit me, I will just go and get it so uh, we can get into the discussion proper. <laughs> Sorry for keeping you waiting. <laughs> that is for you. It, it, just a small token. It, you know, you are one man who has continued to work for the gods of this kingdom. And you have been working so well. Uh, this is just something I have packaged for you. You know, to make you feel okay. So that you, you can continue to work for the men of this kingdom as a man. You know, you know, what I am saying in essence is that you, you need to use your good offices as the priest to make things easy for the men you know, so, so that they, they can operate freely as men who are the owners of the land. You, you understand what I'm saying? You know, you know, there's no need you know, pushing the men to the wall where they will be so frustrated. Yeah? Even the whole just like, hey, God deliver me work easy. For it to be easy for the man. This is for you. 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 This I don't need your money. Keep your money. The girls are for the men, the same way they are for the women. Don't ever attempt to bribe the priest. Hey, it is not bribe. And, and why, why will such word come into your mouth? It is not bribe. It, it, it is just something I have given you, you know, from the depth of my heart. Because I know you work so much for the gods, you are not working, you know, for the money. So people like us who work so much for the money should be able to take care of people like you, you understand? That is what I have given you. It's just for you to, you know, feel happy as you are doing your job and make things easy for the men. That's all. I have delivered the message. Do the needful. Do the needful. But you are forgetting something here. What is wrong with this man? Yeah? This man has no money. And he is rejecting money. Cash. In this cashless economy. What the hell is going on? Why are you tracking me like this? What the boss name are you? Like, are you doing my eh? I am here for the money you promised me. The what rubbish money are you talking about? I am here for the 100k you promised to give me after the abortion. You even said we we're going to travel. Which God knows I was never going to travel with you. But you see the cash, the 100k. That's what I'm here for. I must collect that one. Look at your man. You think you can reap where you did not sow? Let me tell you, Gechi. I am no longer interested in any relationship with you. Upe. Understand that. I know. You're no longer interested. Same as me. I am equally tired of this nonsense we've been doing. Maduka, this is the second time I'm, I'm confronting you because of this money. The third one, I will involve your wife. And I will do it in a way that you feel like killing me. But let me tell you, 10 of you can do nothing to me. <laughs> Maduka, that is what I am. You can do nothing to me. You're just blabbing. You're just blabbing. Okay. Get out of my compound. I will come again in front of your wife. I will come again. Try me. I will come again. What type of faithful spirit is this? 
This girl will not kill me. Oh. Uh, so, Chief, uh, how did it go? He turned down the money. Hmm? I offered him. He actually walked out on me. He came all the way to your house and still turned down the money. Hey, look, the way he actually approached the issue is not good at all. He was very mean. Very mean and unapproachable. So, why did he turn down your money? That man who has been standing before date all his life, we actually want the right thing to be done. So, what exactly is he planning to do? The same thing we have been avoiding. That's what he wants. Any man who wants to catch the wife through the process of cleansing must have to make himself available and take an oath first. That he is sure that the wife is not that the wife is actually cheating. I don't understand. That's what he wants. He said, I mean, how could he say that kind of nonsense? Is he okay? I don't understand. Are you giving up very easily? We need this man on our side. If not, I'm with you now. Hey, Luca. You know, I never give up on anything. I pursue things to the end. But leave this one. I know how best to approach him. How? I don't know. How are you going to approach him? Is she happy there? He, he, he don't understand. I gave this man 400,000 naira cash in this cashless economy. He rejected it. What else do you want to give him? He gave you cash and rejected it. We transfer him. Yes. Transfer him to our side and transfer him. In fact, transfer his entire worldview so that he will see things from our own perspective. And then he will fall in line with us. So we transfer his very personality to our side. I've been looking for you. Now you have seen me, any problem? I want you to stay away from Madoka. Stay away from Madoka, he is my man. <laughs> I thought you have something important to say. And listen, Nkeshi, listen. This will be the first and the last you pull the stones and stay away from Manuka. It's mine. Hey, it's yours. How is he yours? Are you his wife? He belongs to me, aside his wife. And there is no other third woman. <laughs> Get? Daydreamer. Wake up from your dream, Unne. Wake up. You're looking at me as if you don't like me. Huh? The truth is that it starts gradually. And with time, I assure you, you're gonna like me. <laughs> um you know. It's this very stupid attitude of yours. I mean, this nasty attitude of yours that make people feel you cannot call the police on civil matters like this, this attitude. Why are you talking about the police here? Huh? I'm just here to let you know how I feel. I already know your husband's timetable and I know your husband will not be back yet. So you don't have any reason to be scared or worried. Wow. Just wow. So, automatically you know I am married. Huh? Right? Yes. Very good. And because you know my husband's schedule, you have the nerves to walk into my compound and tell me you like me. Are you not stupid? Like, 
Are you not daft? You are just being too rigid, huh? Calm down, loosen up. All these ladies you look up to, they all have bangers by the corner. I assure you that whatever we share is going to be kept secret. So, I've had enough of your stupidity. Right about now, I want you to get your ass out of my compound. I will surely leave your compound, but I just want you to listen to what I have to say. Um, you know, you're not the only one who is hitting on me. So I won't be wrong if I say this whole thing is a planned deal. <laughs> a planned deal? Oh no, call that crap. I'm bigger than that. My name is Kennedy, like I told you earlier on. I am here for real business. What I feel for you is real and genuine, okay? And also, I want you to give me a chance in your life. I'm going to give you remarkable memories. I'll take you to places you've never been before. Um, please remind me your name again. Kennedy. Okay, Kennedy, whatever. I, I think you know my husband, right? Of course, yes. You see how built he is. Like his physique is tall, he's handsome. You know my husband very well. So I'm wondering what gave you the nerves. I'm wondering what gave you the mind to step into my husband's compound to say and spill trash. Before I close my eyes and open them, I want you to take your sorry self out of my house now. I said no! I will leave your house, okay? You don't have to yell at me. I will leave. But I just want you to look into what I'm here to say. Get the hell! You have, you to, have, think, no... you have to think Come about on, get out of my compound. What's, what's, just look at you. I will give you remarkable memories. You know, Rich, do you know who my husband is? Remarkable. Come back here. A guy now, wow. Now what to you? You just forget your guy. And they talk you they laugh. Mm, see as you just cast for this hood. Pata pata. I know they see you again. What did they play? My guy. Nobody say I don't want to see you. But just that these days I'm always busy at the warehouse. You understand? So that's why I hardly come out. The warehouse. Yes, the warehouse. You have been busy at the warehouse. Yeah, my brother warehouse. Okay, the warehouse. So as it is like this now, you don't forget about your worker. You don't forget about Jan, Dabi. No. Who tell you? I never forget though. Uh, the point is that since my brother refused to help me, uh. you understand? And I can't reason now. See, if I didn't show up. All of them enjoy a part of making the money now, but I have plans. So, if we can go say he will settle me after eight months, so my plans be say if he settle me, I will gather the money. I don't move. Eighteen months. Yes, now. One, two, three, four, ten, eighteen. Eighteen months. Yeah, yeah, six months. I don't move. I know. See, this way they talk like this, I know. Be you, they talk out because I they get feeling say trauma. Choma has a hand in this. She talked you into this. My brother, not be Choma. I'm telling you, as a matter of fact, I have not seen Choma for a very long time now. I have not seen her. So, you know, be sure, I just make up my mind. Say, instead of wasting around, let me just get myself busy with something. You have not seen Choma? I've not seen her. I don't understand. Why now? She broke up with me. Woke up one morning, see, she's no longer interested. I let her be now. Just like that? Just like that. Choma, where you they always follow? Pium, pium, pium. Here, there. Here, there. You, you know, finally, you now let her go. I just told you now, see, she woke up, say she's no longer interested. A woman says she's no longer interested. What does it mean? Go your way, I go my way. Then I let her go now. What do you want me to do? Did I force her? No. How would I force her now? Mm. You understand? It's alright uh, now. Uh, uh, another thing is this, Okudule. You know now that I have engaged myself in doing something, I think it's high time you do the same. 
Yes, now. You want me to join you at your brother's shop? No, you're not joining me. You're a criminal. Get something to do. <laughs> you understand? Because now people will be seeing you that I'm now, I'm now okay. I'm behaving normal, but I'm still moving around with a criminal. You, you, you be idiot. You be idiot. You, you be, be my guy. Idiot. You are behaving normal. They try to let me know, say, are, are they abnormal, Abi? No, I mean you are jo you are jobless assistance now. So get something to do. Guy, I go enter you. I go enter you. I go enter you sharply. Once more, you are welcome to my place. Thank you, great one. So, what has brought you to my place? A great one. Uh, here, here. What is this? Great one. Why not open it and uh, see for yourself what it contains? Yeah? Open it. See for yourself. Eh? Appetit. Yeah, great one. Appetit, I don't have time for this. What do you have inside? Ah, okay, yeah, great one. Great one. You see? This envelope contains documents for 20 plus of land. 20 plus of land. In fact, uh, your friend, you know, knows that I'm here. And what business have I got to do with papers of 20 plus of land? <sighs> with, uh, you see, right now, these 20 plus of land belong to you. They are all yours. Yeah? Um, in fact, your name is on all of them. Yeah? Uh, but we want you to do just one thing for us. Just one thing. Any woman of Obodenu who is accused of infidelity must go for cleansing. But the husband of that woman shall have absolutely nothing to do with the process. That is all. That's why we brought this one. Yeah? Apiti, have you seen a madman since you were born? <laughs> madman. Oh, if you, uh, there are madmen all over the place. Eh? In fact, I even saw one while I was on my way to this place. Uh, I mean, what has a, a madman got to do with uh, what we are talking about? Eh? If you don't leave here this moment with these cost papers of yours, I will make you run mad. If you baby Naja, uh, it has not gotten to this. Yeah, we are still talking. I, I really want you to see things from our own uh, perspective, our own point of view, so that uh, uh, things will be properly handled uh, in Obudin. Yeah, you are the authority here. Yeah? There is only one thing that will make you believe that it has gotten to that point. Animals. What happened? Hey! Obwepi wanted to strike me with madness. Eh? What happened? He rejected the land gift together. And when I tried to pressurize him, hey, the man flared up. Wait. That means if Ekego has succeeded in turning his mind against us. That is what it means, you. Hey! That is what it means. Yeah. So, how are we going to do this? Anyway, I already have a plan. Mm. Yes. Don't worry about that. Let's go. Please, speed up with your plan. Don't worry. If not, we are finished though. Don't worry again, man. Trust me. Mama, we shall.
You smile for me now, man. Not until you tell me what you're still doing with that rascal, girl. Amaka, my yoli yoli. Eh? My tata, you know there is nothing again I have to do with that idiot. Eh? I have nothing in common with her again. Then why is she still embarrassing me and telling me how much of you? She did what? She nearly fucked me today. Like, Madoka, mm -hmm. tell her to stay away from me. Okay, it's all right. I'm sorry if that is what she did. I know how to handle her. I know exactly what to do. Okay? You have to. I've been. You're a smile now. Look at me, look at me. Look at my smile for me now. Smile. <laughs> you don't know what it does to me when you shine your teeth. Eh? You think they touch me. Eh? Yeri, yeri. Oh, oh, driver now. Eh? We are going to a very conducive environment to, you know, now at least. Yeah, uh, I guess I will oh. kill you. Oh! <laughs> this one girl, you will not kill me. Hey, hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Oh, but then, oh, hey, hey. Are we men are not slaves? So we yeah. are yeah. I greet you too, young man. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine, thank you. And who are you and what can I do for you? Okay. Firstly, uh, I'm Mr. Kennedy by name. Okay. And I've been willing to see you and talk to you about something that if you can do for me, I'll be very, very grateful. All right. Uh, let's help. Let's hear. Let's hear you. Let's see what it is. Uh, I, uh, I, I like your wife, and I want to make her my wife also. Uh, sorry. Uh, please say that again. <laughs> I just said I like your wife, and I want to make her my wife also. Oh, here she comes. So beautiful. Uh, hold on. You, you say you like my wife. Yes. And then you want. Um, to make her yours. Well, uh, I can understand if maybe I didn't present the matter well to you. I know you must have invested a lot on her for her to look so fresh, just like a yesterday virgin. I want you to name your price. Whatever the amount is, let me know, I'll pay it. Hey, 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 are you mad? Uh, don't worry, I'll handle this. Young man, you you came to my house to insult me. Oh no, that's okay. It's fine. You can leave. Oh, I won't leave here. Hey, hey, I've heard everything that you've said. For now, leave my house while I think about your about your demand. Just just go. No, I won't leave just like that. You have to give me an answer now. Any amount, I'll pay you off. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Please, oh, 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 Where are you coming from? Hey, look, this is my husband's house. And I am back to my husband's house. If my husband wants me to be cleansed, then he has to present himself first to be cleansed. And when he is done, I will present myself to be cleansed too. Really? Yes. Whoever is feeding you with these useless and stupid ideas is lying to you. Because it does not work like that in this kingdom. Yes, men of Obodenu do not go for cleansing. <laughs> hey, when will you people be tired of this lie you have cooked up to intimidate women with, to hold them down with? Because I know the truth now. 
I am talking about what the chief priest said about a situation like this. Yes, I read it in the women's platform. And it states that if you want me to take an oath that I cheated on you, first you have to take the oath to say that you saw me in the hotel with the man. And when you are done taking the oath, then I will take the oath to defend myself that I was not in the hotel with any man. That is how it works. And whenever you're ready, my darling, I'm ready too. Wait, who put this nonsense, this, this stupid lie you just told now, who put in the women's platform? It is not a lie and you know it. Because if it were a lie, the chief priest would have refuted it. But since he did not refute it, then every man of Obudin must abide by it, including you. Anyway, like I said, when you are ready to be cleansed, I am ready to. This is not the calm, gentle, and peaceful and yet that I am married. Who even put her in that woman's platform in the first place? How did she get there? Hey. God, you're going to This is not good at all. I don't like this. I don't like it one bit. Look, all the logistics needed for the execution of this project we provided. Why did you fail? Why? Eh? Ichi, she is very hard to get. That woman loves her husband so much. She can't be enticed with material things. So, what is the way forward? Ichi, hmm? you need to take it the hard way. I was going to say that. I was going to say that. But the issue is, are you guys ready for it? We're ever ready, 100%. As long as you're going to foot the bill. Money is not the problem. Money can never be an issue, as far as I'm concerned. The point is, are you guys ready for it? Like we told you, 100% we're ready. Okay. Um, listen, this night, eh, all your individual accounts will be credited. I want you to commence with immediate effect. See that this job is executed. I don't want excuses, please. No excuses this time around. Ichi, immediately we get the money. Consider the job done. Hundred percent. This night, like I said, your individual accounts shall be credited. Eh? No excuses, please. And um, see that you communicate with Jude. Okay. Then the development and please. No excuses. Iche, 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 Apiti One. Iche, this man pays very well. Iche has an agenda, and he will go at all costs to achieve his agenda. I wonder where he gets all the money that he gives to us. <laughs> Ichi Apiti is not alone in this. He will surely have some money bags behind him. Hmm. <laughs> chooks, chooks, mo go go. Mo aneli kandi obosi. You're making up this. Does it look like I'm making this up? Of course not. I mean, my husband came to me the other day telling me that his brother was ready to join him in the business. Wow. <laughs> so it's what? 
Of course it did work. And all thanks to you, my darling. <laughs> You're welcome. So where is he? Well, he's busy in, in the warehouse, you know, trying to pack things, arrange things. Okay, so I will stop over at the warehouse to see him later. You should. You know, your presence is very important. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so right about now, I should be leaving. You know, fix some things before my husband comes back. Sure. <laughs> Take care of you, okay? Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. All right. <sighs> Don't be too excited. No, I, I, I should. So my baby finally turned a new leaf. God, you did this for me. You deserve all my praise. Thank you. I will praise you. I will praise you. I will praise you. I will praise you. Hey! If I can go, are you going to claim you don't know what men can do when, when they feel their ego is bruised? I don't see why anyone's ego should be bruised here. Oh no, we are talking about women here. Our women. Women married into our land, we owe it to them to speak up for them. It's our duty, it's our responsibility. Oh no. Do you understand what you are doing if I can go? What am I doing? No, 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 you are trying to teach our women the dynamics of power. If they manage to understand what you are teaching them, they will not use the power well. Why don't you understand this? And men who presumably understand the dynamics of power, what have they done with it? If not use it for their personal gains. I can't sit and see something going wrong and not fight it and not talk about it. Oh no, and if this is the reason you have invited me here, I would respectfully ask that we do not carry on with this discussion, I'm sorry. I need to understand this. Are you telling me you are sitting before you know of Obodain? And you are telling me to my face that you are not going to obey my orders? No, you have not given me an order. What you have done is try to coerce me into aligning with you to keep our women suppressed. That's what you are asking. And I have said no. I will not do it. And I stand on what I have said. You stand on what you say. Without apologies. Babe. Babe. Hey! Hey! Who are you? Like I always tell you, it does not matter. Hey, baby, please, 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 please don't hurt me, please. Ah! 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 No, since he does not want to leave us alone, we are going to touch the very heart of his life. Yes. Are you sure this is going to work? Why not? It has worked already. I don't know why I am not very comfortable with this whole arrangement. Same with me. Uh, maybe because I have not done this before. Listen to me. There is no cause for alarm. Eh? This is something I have done before. I have done it over and over and over. 
I will still do it anytime the need arises. Yes. Don't bother yourselves. I'm in charge. I'm on top of the situation. Yeah. Baby. Sweetheart. Babe. Yet. Yet. Look, I'm coming. Where, where are you going? Let me see if I'm coming now. Come here. Okay. They are calling already. Hello? Oh, that's good. That's good. Uh, hold on. I hope you were not followed. Not at all. Oh, okay. Okay. Um. Oh, we have to meet immediately. Eh? So I'll tell you what the demand is. Yes. Uh, you need to put a call across to the husband. Where is the meeting point? Um, that road that leads to the Anglican Church. What time? Right about now. In fact, I'm already on my way to that place. Yeah? All right, Iche. I will catch up with you shortly. Yeah, quickly, quickly. Yeah, yeah we don't have time to lose. have to go and meet you there. Good, I've already. Yeah? Mr. Bandura, the demand there. Remember the demand there. You know, baby. Let me. Mama. Are you comfortable with this arrangement? If you know, like Mana Bana Monyori, I never knew that the Shia party has always been a kidnapper or this while I wouldn't know. Just said that he has been doing it. Be hey, careful. I mean, one has to be careful with the people you let yourself with. The Shia party. Yes. What's the next move? 
He will call her husband. Tell him to stop whatever he is beheading for the women of Obedeen. If he wants his wife to return to him in one piece. I don't understand you, sir. We're not supposed to be asking of money. What money are you talking about? Did I not give you guys money? This is not about making money from him. No. We don't need his money. It is all about teaching him a lesson. A lesson he will forever remember. Hmm? Good. So you call him. Tell him to stop this fight. He is launching against the men of Obodenu Kingdom. Otherwise, his wife will be returned to him as pieces of meat packed inside the sad bag. Tell him that. Is that all you want? That is all. I'll do it. Good. And I know you can do it. Please, sir. Please. Whatever I've done, please forgive me. I'm begging in the name of God. Please don't kill me, please. I'm begging. Keep quiet. Okay, sir. Okay. Nobody's going to kill you if you behave yourself. Okay, okay. But if you don't, hey. you're as good as dead. <laughs> I'm sorry. Please, I'll behave myself, please. I'll behave myself. Hey. Rule number one. No talking. No movement. I want this place to be as quiet as a graveyard. Mm -hmm. Understood? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Please, 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 I'm begging. Shut up! Mm -hmm. You mad. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Ichi. You get what I want to ask you now? She get quanta with anybody. No, not at all. What about your brother? You know, see, he get as your brother they do. He get as in we be, we are not understand. Your brother get enemy anywhere. My brother is a peace-loving man. I don't think he has enemies. No worry yourself. No just worry yourself. We will find her. And we will see her. You feel me so? this that question does not matter because in the course of our discussion you will get to know who I am okay who are you okay I'm listening to you we have your wife what please 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 I beg you please 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 just don't just, just don't hammer her please I beg you please please don't touch her please shut up if you ask me one more question without my permission If you ever want to see her alive again, you must jettison the movement you just initiated to ridicule the men of Obodenu. If you fail to do that and let the women know that they belong to their husbands, 
your wife will be returned to you in a bag cut into pieces of meat. Hey. Okay, uh, can, I, can, I, can I talk to her? Please. You have 10 seconds. Hey, hello, oh. baby. Hey, baby. Um, how are you? Are you okay? I'm not okay. Baby, please oblige them. I want to leave here, please. Hey, Mr. Man, uh. your time starts now. Hey. And if by two days you do not get to see that moment, I will kill your wife hey. and I'll come after you. Uh, uh, hold on, hold on, listen. Hello? Please, 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 sir. Sorry, sir. Please, please, please don't kill me. You quiet. Hey, this is injustice. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men, Lord? You are not hungry. Why? I've lost appetite. I don't want to eat. Oh, really? I guess you want to go home. Yes, sir. Please let me go home, please. I'll tell my husband to stop whatever it is he's doing. Please let me go. Please. Until your husband does that. That is when you will leave here. Oh God. For now, since you don't want to eat, I have to eat now. Hey God, I want him. Oh God. Madam. Oh, yeah, you, you have a choice now, Abby. They are serving you food. You don't want to eat. If I hear pain from your mouth again. Sorry. Sorry, sir. We heard what happened. We were so sorry. But have they contacted you? Yes, they have. So what are they demanding? They are asking that I jettison the movement for the emancipation of our women. I thought as much. Are you going to do that? Never. If going ahead with the movement, you put the life of your wife in danger. Then withdraw from it. Exactly, please. No, never, no, no. No, never. There's no backing down. There's no way. There's no way that is going to happen. If indeed there is, there is a God of justice and a God for the down throat, this is when that God should rise up. Our women cannot continue to live like this. No way. There is no way evil is going to triumph over good. I say no. They have my wife, yes. But this movement must happen. I don't ID the boys we run that movement. Who are they? Funny enough, they are from this same kingdom of ours. I wish about this. I be the same Oku Dili, we know the streets. My ears, they always dig ground 247 for any 411. Okay. Are they 100% sure? Okay. Okay. So how do we track them? Follow me, make I show you. Follow me. Oh no! Oh no! You can not pretend to be ignorant about what is going on. Right now, my wife is missing. I'm asking you, where is she? Do I look like your wife's keeper? Do I? Oh no. Oh no, you're nearer your end. You know, but they know that you know. 
Oh no, I just want to remind you that men who think that they have become knowledgeable must not forget that they were taught by someone. They are learners, oh no, and their teachers are masters. I don't know what you're talking about. They are learners, oh no, who and they are, their teachers are masters. I don't know what you are talking about. What I am talking about is that they are masters. They are children. So the ones that they think that they taught you. I have my eyes on you. I'm going to teach you every time I see you. You learn the hard way. That age has nothing to do with wisdom. My very beautiful wife will be coming back from the UK today. And I wouldn't want a fool like you to show his face around here when my wife is around. If that happens, you are not going to like how I will handle you. See about what? You call me a fool. What I mean? <laughs> oh no! You! And your cohorts came together and kidnapped my wife so as to force me to jettison my plans of liberating our women from the bondage that men like you have created just to put them in check. Huh? But I tell you that that check is coming. And when that check comes, men like you will fall in line. You are a fool to stand before the you know who of Obodonu and use such words. I am the masquerade that is presently leading the way and nobody can force me into any line. Ah. No one can force you into any line. Can I call him? I call him one. Put your hand on your back. Get out of my face. 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 Enu na na manaka mo dio chao How can I pay for a sin I never commit Man, I've been thinking about something, huh? As long as you are not getting any good pay, any good money from this job, eh? Mm -hmm. What if you chop that woman? Sorry, the Chris. Are you, are you sick in the head? Nah, that thing. Don't tell me you're possibly not in the idea of eating somebody's wife. Huh. Baba, we did to that. Uh, uh, somebody's wife, somebody's wife, somebody's wife. Does it matter? Nah, check this thing. Oh. Does it matter? It does not matter to you. One night, it matters a lot to me. What are you saying, bro? It matters to me. Ha. Ha. Since when did you start having cold feet? Eh? You know I'm only doing this because I was paid to do it. The same here. So uh, that I'm paid to do it does not mean I will, I will go as far as being among the group that actually rapes a woman. No, no, no I won't go. I won't, I won't take it that far. Come on, man. See, listen, eh? This woman, she's already vulnerable. She will do anything we ask for her because she wants freedom. She wants to leave this place. Nah, check what this woman oh. Have you looked at that woman? But I don't hold you for body. Have you looked at that woman? You don't see that woman? Oh God, see. If you want to eat her, go ahead. You have the green light. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not like you're coming to take permission from me. I'll be in a trace of you in the fight. Come on. Come on, you go. No, nah, I'll be trace of you in the fight. Go and eat her. But I will not be involved. Please don't involve me. Nah, nah, you know, nah, you know, nah, you know. I hope you're chopped and see why, bro. Come on. Ha. Oh, wow. Hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Oh, but then, oh, hey. Hey, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care I still can't believe that something like that could happen in this town This man are behind it so, why are you not involving the police? This is no longer a civil case. 
It's a criminal offense. So you need to brief the police. I can't be thinking of the police right now when these boys have my, my wife in their, in their custody. Right? I'm, 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 I'm applying wisdom here. I'm, I'm following this up gradually. But I'll have you know, and anyone who cares to listen, that whatever my wife comes back to tell me that those boys did to her, I am going to unleash on the owner where his cause in multiple folds. So what is your plan for our return? I have a plan. I might not give you specific details, but trust me, I have a plan. Okay. Oh, have you eaten? I have appetite. Okay. Um, what about your brother? Is he aware of the happenings? Yes. Uh, no vex, I block you under this hot sun. You understand? You get waiting who your man wear wear for neck. I don't know if I feel get ten k from you. I beg. I don't understand. As um, Page, what makes you feel like I have the money here? No be no be like that. You understand? I just get waiting choke me where well, where. Well. If you don't even get the ten k, anything where you get, it's well. It's okay by me. You understand? You don't smoke? No, I don't smoke. I'll just give you two K. No wala. Man, no carry and buy cigar. No wala, Baba. Thank you very much. You na boss. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. And it's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh. Someone need to rise and fight over the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. So our women are not slaves. Over the new. Hey, our women are not slaves. So our women are not slaves. Mm -hmm. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Our men are treating us like slaves Someone need to stand up hey, Someone need to stand up Someone need to rise Someone need to speak up And add the women's mind That's getting out of hand I'm not hungry. Do you have to eat? Not hungry. Oh no, my dear. The aim is oh. hunger will soon catch up with her. And once that happens, <laughs> trust me, she go beg for food. She go beg. That is always the issue with them. She would definitely beg for food. How about since you're already here, let's go and pick up some things. You guys should hurry up. Of course. And be careful. Sure. We're not spending much time. Before you know it, we're back. You better eat now that you're still alive. You speak gently, sir. I know you cannot hurt an innocent woman. Please. Please, I'm begging in the name of God Almighty. Let me go, please. Shut up! Zebe! Please come to my rescue. Please, God.
Do you know any of them? Mm -hmm. I suspect some of the spies that always come around to ask them. You don't have to worry yourself. You know them. It's a good thing that you are back in this house. So go in, take a shower, and have something nice to eat. We we'll, we'll handle the food. And I, I also think you may need the doctor's attention. You're right. Um, brother. We're going now. It's a good thing you came on time. I felt it in my spirit that they were going to be here. But they didn't touch you. They did not touch you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to deal with this man. You didn't just say that. I mean, how is that possible? Hey, I thought you said that they are professionals. Eh? How did it just happen? So what's going to happen now? Eh? Where are we going to hide? There is no hiding place for a criminal like you. You are very heartless, Eloka. Eh, you are very heartless. What did you just say? You heard me. I said you are heartless. Because you want to suppress the truth and keep women under and keep suppressing them not to enjoy their liberty as human beings. You decided to kidnap an innocent woman. Hmm. Well, Eloka, eh, your cup is full. Be careful, just as woman. Be careful. Uh, Who told you I kidnapped anybody? Uh, I don't need to be told. The vigilante group you set up to arrest criminals are here to arrest the real criminal. You people can call me now. Agnete. I did not do anything. Hi, Agnete. Agnete, you get mind. Okay, Your husband. Me. I did not do anything to you. You get mind. Agnete, mm -hmm. give this to your husband. Husband, wicked and heartless husband. A bad you can. Move. Move. Move him. See what we're dealing with right now. I said it, no one cared to listen. It would not have cost you man, anything at all to let our women enjoy their freedom and peace. No. Huh? We have to control everything. Huh? Relationships are built on trust and not built on coercive dimensions as your cleansing represents. Did I not talk about it? Oh, I talked about it. I cried. I cried. I talked about it. I came here several times to talk to you about it, but no, you didn't listen. But look at both of you now. Huh? You have shot yourselves in the leg. We don't have to waste time here, sir. Hello, and the sheriff. I have the order of the police to arrest you for kidnapping. Are you out of your mind? Uh -huh. 
No, no, are you out of your mind? I am the owner who of this kingdom, and I am the one who is in charge of the vigilante. Oh. What makes you think you can arrest a man like uh, me? Oh, oh no, well, calm down, calm down, calm down. Uh, it's not a shouting matter, calm down. Uh, you'll have to cooperate with this man. Oh yes, they have been sent here by the police. Uh, do not resist arrest or man the man that the police shows up here now. That they can walk here now, they can walk here now. The man like here, uh, will come here now, let's see get up. Just go with this man. Cooperate with, them. cooperate with the vigilante that you incorporated into this country. Yeah, 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 if I can go, if I can go, look, you're a fool, you're a big fool for rising against your kinsmen. In fact, I promise you, you will regret this. Okay, you will regret it. Uh, just like you're regretting your very dirty ploy to have our women in bondage for the rest of your lives for your own selfish reasons. Look at you, each other, they look at you. You have done the crime. You are going to do the time. Huh? No, no, no. Who, who the hell do you think you are? Who the hell do you think you have to believe you can jail a man like me? Uh, listen to me, please. Come shouting at me. Uh, uh. Listen, you don't have, you've lost it in this community. As far as this community is concerned, you, you, you've lost it. We don't have respect for you anymore. When people are talking, you know, you cannot be talking, for you do not have the interest of our people at heart. Uh, as if you're a man of authority. No, you have lost your place in the heart of the people. Do your job. Push this man out. No, move. 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 Someone need to rise Someone need to speak up And add it with his mind It's getting out of hand Our women are not slaves Oh Someone need to rise and fight Go for the new Hey Our women are not slaves Our women are not slaves over the night, I, I, we men are not slaves. Oh, we men are not slaves. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us?